Okay, I think we're live. Not according to YouTube yet. No. Yeah. Okay. What's up, Betty? Betty? There it goes. It's spinning. Hold on. Okay. There we are. Okay. Hi, everyone. I've got Michelle and Patty with me, and then Laurel's going to come in when she gets home from work. Okay, somebody needs to mute. Uh, it's not me. That would be you, Patty Lang. Oh. No, nope, it's not it's Patty me. Lang. It's me. It's, it's uh, Michelle. Told ya. <laughs> told ya. Oh, man. I even went in and, and muted it. It was real. Hi, Julia. Hey, Eddie. Hey, Virginia. Hey, Maggie. Hi, Patty. Hey. What's up? What's Not up? Much. Hi, Julia. I ate some tags and ephemera with Adam, my friends. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Get it over with. <laughs> You're the one that worded it, not me. I know. And don't think I'm not going to change it once this is over. <laughs> All right, so how about we chat for a little bit before we get down to crafting? Hi, Linda. Linda Carruthers, look, it's Patty Lang. It's Patty. Right <laughs> She's driving through Indianapolis hey, right now on her way home to you. <laughs> Hi, Joanne. Hey, Julia. Hey, Joanne. Yep. Although the good news is I'm not driving. I'm in the passenger seat. Yep. Hubby's driving. Yep. <laughs> So I had to do something with this camera. I may turn this thing off watching it, and I'm like, ooh, this thing is really pixely. Uh, you look pretty clear on Yeah, uh, you're clear, but um, you froze. But we can hear you, though. Okay. I'm pixely on YouTube, of course. So what's everybody doing tonight? You're going to craft with us? You're going to watch? What you doing? I'm going to watch. Thank goodness, Patty. <laughs> Patty said I'm going to watch. <laughs> You're not going to bust out a craft bag? No, I think, I think I'll leave it packed. It'll be all right. <laughs> I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Yep. So are you working on tags tonight, Michelle? You're going to work on more tags or are you going to do something different? Um, I'm going to try out something a little different. Now I'll let you nice. know what's out, all right? <laughs> nice. Thanks. Working with this old vintage metal buckle that cost a quarter. It's a casual buckle for so many uses. Of course, I'm going to this thing for ephemera though because that is really cool hi donna. Hey, donna pretty cool right that's cool that's yeah that's old yeah only cost a quarter hey donna what up girl Oh, Angie's got all the in-laws for dinner, but she'll be here for a bit. Hi, hey, Roy. Roy. How are you doing? Hey, Roy. Happy Thursday to you. <clears throat> oh, he's got quiet practice in a bit, but he's here for a little while. Okay. I have your last video in my watch later, Roy. I'm a little bit behind. But I'll be watching. I go like that. 
Hello, Lisa Jameson. Hi, Lisa. Hey, Lisa. Look, it's Patty. She's alive and she's alive. <laughs> she's here. <laughs> <laughs> so Roy wait till I get, get home you guys we have a new mask you what Patty yeah what you say Patty you bathroom remodel oh I was just yeah, going to say Roy we have a new mask nice oh. yeah it was um like the never-ending bathroom bathroom remodel, I'm, I think. How are you, Lisa? So, are you still in Indianapolis, Patty? Um, yeah, North Side. Welcome, Joanne. It's her first time in chat. Hey, Joanne. But she says she's familiar with us crafters. Nice. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, Joanne? <laughs> Nowadays it can go either way. Oh, Roy says it's almost done waiting for some final stuff. It failed the plumbing inspection and then oh, painting is next. No. Wow. <clears throat> that is the never ending yeah. plumbing. I'm doing okay, Lisa. Still look like a pirate. Arg <laughs> made it. Uh, yeah, that's so much fun. <laughs> she never gets tired of hearing me say that. I know. Every time I see her, it's arg. <laughs> <laughs> she said it last night. She was, uh, yeah, I know. not original. <laughs> he was like, man. Yeah, I said, hey, Jay, I've heard them all. <laughs> <laughs> The one that gets me is the emoji, the emoji that's winking with one eye. And Maggie sent it to me and she goes, one eye, get it? <laughs> hey, Mags. Oh, here's Laurel, yeah? Okay. Yeah, she's here. Hi, right. Hi Linda. Yeah, she's Hi, here. Ann. Hi, everyone. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Mag. Hi, Patty. Hi, Laurel. Hey, Laurel. Long hey, Laurel. Time. I know, isn't it? <laughs> it I we are now. Oh, thanks, Lisa. So, what's everyone doing? Obviously, Patty's driving and We've showing us chatting. scenery. Just been chatting, waiting for you. Nice. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Lisa. Who did I miss? Should I go back and just there's, go through everyone? Probably not. Julia. You can if you want. <clears throat> Hi, Virginia. Hi, Lisa. How is everybody today? And oh, sitting here, I might as well sit and work on this for a few minutes before I pull out my paper and my, my inks. You making a new bracelet? No, I'm working on that piece of tatting I was showing you. Oh, okay. It's sitting here, so but I'm going to play with my inks in a little bit, but I might as well work on this for a minute while I'm sitting here. Oh, man. I wasn't supposed to get ink on it. Bummer. You got ink on it? Yeah, the other piece that I wasn't supposed to, but that's okay. I'll cover it up. Patty, are you just sitting quietly? I am. <laughs> now, how far away from home are you now, Patty? Um, hour and a half ish. Oh, that's not bad. Uh uh. Nice. Oh, Virginia's straightening nice. her craft room. Nice. That's when you find all the good stuff. 
Virginia, want to come and straighten mine for me? I know, me too. I, I, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> I really would. Yeah. Although I need mine more or less needs the organization. Just making a mess out of it. Patty, Lisa wants to know if you got a lot of shopping done. I did. Indeed, I did. <laughs> Roy. Hi, Roy. He said, Patty, I saw a big bird flying down the road in the cloud you, you filmed. I'm going to check with my shrink. Not sure what that means. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. I want to know what the either. shrink tells him. Yeah. Boy, my phone has quite the lag, doesn't it? What are you working oh, on, Max? I'm going to make a couple more tags. Um, mm. Donna comment, um, put a post in there for you, Michelle. Hi. And trying to remember to stay in frame. I got you. Yeah, I need to put like mark an X so I know right where center is. Let me see if I can do this here. I know. So I'm in frame. No, you, I'm blurry anyway, so it doesn't matter about me. It's, you're not blurry. On YouTube, I am. Yeah. No, you well, it goes in and it's going in and out. And Jay's not in here, so I have the internet all to myself, but you know how that goes. Yeah. All right, I need to thin my fabric tack. Nail polish. Remover. 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 Yep. Okay. Yes, ma'am. And then it'll be like, you'll be like, oh my God, it works so nice right now. Lots or little drops at a time or. Um, um, tell me how much is in your bottle. It's taking a while. It's about right here in my sugar bell. I would bowl. put in like a half an inch. Okay. A little less and then just start stirring it. During it. I hate to go, but dinner is all right. Have a good dinner, Ange. Have a good dinner, Ange. Bye. Oh yeah, she has company for dinner, family. That's right. right. Let me go get some nail polish. Okay. Yes, all enjoy right. your dinner. To the Merkel Antioch. How's the scenery, Patty? Um, kind of foggy, dreary, dreary. Wow. Yeah, it's raining here. Oh, oh. Did, oh. did you wave to Cam when you went by? Yes, I did. Okay. I did. I even shot off a flare so that she knew it would be. <laughs> Good. Lisa wants to know, Patty, have you ever been to the Markle Antique Shop? Oh, you answered her. Never mind. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know why. I asked her where it's at, so we'll see. And I probably have horrible lag, too, so. Okay, here it goes. It's not going to blow up in my face, right? No. No. You just want to stir it really good for a little bit. Half an inch. All right, half an inch in. Okay. I did overflow mine, though. And it'll be like brand new, and you'll be like, oh, wow. I'm ready. I'm ready. Um, Lisa says, up by Fort Wayne, Markle, Indiana. And I have not. I'm like, hmm, sounds like maybe I should. Yeah, it's an antique shop. 
can't see it's her. It's giant. Okay. I think it's going to have to happen. Check it out. Yeah, because Fort Wayne's not far from me, so. You don't have something long and metal to stir it with, Michelle? No. Oh, nice. That'll be fun, Lisa. Or a popsicle stick? No. All right, then just tip it up, all the way upside down and back up and squeeze the bottle as you're doing it. Hi, Julie. Julie, the thrifty paper garden. Hi, Julie. I this pretty crafty community. I've been busy taking care of my mom. Oh. Hey, Julie. It's good to have you here. Max, did you share this in my group? I'm already impatient. Should I add more? What's that? Did you share in my group? Should I add more? No, just keep mushing it around. Yeah, you gotta just yeah, you gotta I'm keep mushing, I'm mushing. So you don't see the liquid, then go ahead and try it. Mush. I don't believe you don't have a popsicle stick or something. I got a pencil. Is it a wood yeah. pencil? Yeah. You can use that. Hi, Angela. Hi, Angela. What How are you? Edge? Oh, thanks, Donna. Yeah, I I can basically do it now with my eyes closed. She does because we keep saying to her, Laurel, open your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that was good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the color off my. Oh, this is a hot mess. What are you doing over there, Michelle? It's the color off my pencil. Now my glue is yellow. <laughs> oh my yeah. God. Not live on Maggie. And we're How about back, a ladies. Knife? Do you have a butter knife? I mean, the fabric tack will come off the butter knife. The butter knife won't stick through the hole. It's too Open big. it up and it will. You're going to stir it. Oh, yeah, you need, wait. You're okay. going to stir it. Right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my, this is just what not to do. One second, I'm being paged by a child. I'm not even five minutes in. Hold on. Okay. Oh, Joanne says she needs some inspiration. Just pull out stuff, lay it all around you, and start playing. That's my suggestion. I was going to say you might want to go to somebody else's chair. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's, there's plenty of inspiration to be found here. I know. I'm just joking. I don't want anybody to go. <laughs> Hey, we got to lighten up a little, you know? Yep. Right. All right. What is that pink? <coughs> That'll make me crazy. Okay. We have to fix that. All right. A butter knife. Yeah. I have a butter knife. Right here. Oh, for people. I can't believe I was trying to do it through that little novel. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> it's really globby. It's globby. Stir it up. And, and some spilled out when I did it. So I think I have that just a bit more. Well, you can add a little bit more if you don't think, but you don't want to make it too thin is the thing. I would put it back on and see how it pours and squeezes out before... Um, before you add more. It's going to come out yellow. No, it's not. Oh, my word. Okay, yeah, I, I didn't think about that. All well, right. I'm, I'm, going to, I'm going to put it on Laurel um, because Lisa is fascinated by your... Oh. 
So let me see. Yeah, my, my, my go-to go project. Okay, there you go. So I'm making a eight inch piece of tatting. I decided, or eight or nine inches, I decided was a good length to go down the side of a page. So um, I don't want to make a long one that anybody has to cut. I think nine inches is a good length and you can just run it along the side of your page or around a corner or something of a frame if you want. Um, and it's just easier to work with. I just, yes, you can cut tatting, but I mean, I know how it goes together. It's not like crochet. So to me, I would rather have a piece that doesn't need to be cut as opposed to a really long piece that I have to cut. You know what I'm right. saying? I don't, I don't really want any of it. So, and I'm, I'm adding beads on here. So I've already, um, pre-strung my thread with my beads. It's just, uh, it's how I've always learned to do it. So it's just easier that way. And I don't need to count or anything anymore. I just kind of, I just kind of know what, <laughs> how many of everything I need to do. I'm going to start. Go oh, ahead. Sorry. Go ahead, Max. No, Jordan asked, um, what Michelle was adding to the fabric tech. She's adding, um, nail polish remover that thins it out a little bit or you can use your acetone or yeah acetone yeah i couldn't find just a hundred percent acetone it's, it's in the same aisle right next to the nail polish remover i have acetone oh you do yeah well the the nail polish remover worked for me so but i'll i'll still look yeah it. it'll work it's the same thing uh so, um, I can't believe I did it through the novel. I've made some doilies with the beads, but I haven't made the long pieces with the beads yet. So I just, I'll hold it up so you guys can see it a little bit. I think it looks really pretty with the beads. It does. Yeah, that's really pretty. Yeah. Julie says, that is inspiring, but not with my eyesight. <laughs> You don't really need to see. Your hands kind of do all the work. I couldn't do it. Come on. And I'm, I'm going to start venturing out and um, turning corners. I know this is, people probably don't know what that means, but I'm going to start going second rows, adding, you know, more to it now. Now that I've got all the basics pretty much down pat, I want to start, you know, okay. got to challenge myself a little more now. <laughs> Don't want it to get too easy. Well, I don't think any of it's easy. But I'm a little anal about my stitches and everything being the same size and facing the right direction. Right, Michelle? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Gotta face the right direction. <laughs> I have learned so much about tatting from Laurel, and we'll go on websites and look at other people's tatting, and she'll say, See that right there? See that right there? And by my eye, it looks fine. And then she'll show me, I'll be like, Oh my goodness, you're right. Very, very educational, this new habit of hers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, any other ladies crafting tonight? Patty is. Oh, thank you, Julia. Oh, thank you, Donna. Yeah, I love to crochet. Oh, well, my new crocheting <laughs> is even smaller than this, but depending on what thread size i'm using um this is uh this is a number um 20. i do use 30 and then i have been using the embroidery threads which are super small so depending on your size thread is going to give you a different size of your project um but i've been doing a little bit different type of crocheting lately too um i'll show you guys one of them i just did a video but um i just made this one like this and this is done with really, really super, super thin thread. Um, and that's just a little thing to go down the side of a page as well. And then I just finished another one last night like this. Let's 
turn it this way. Like that. Yeah, that's cool. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I'm I'm really into this right now too. So I'm like I'm like multitasking lately. <laughs> like I like a little that. bit of this, a little bit of this. Hi Donna, she's making lace tags. Bags. Or base, yeah, lace. Yeah, I can't talk. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead, man. <Maddie. laughs> that was good. Oh, oh gosh. Man. You guys talk. Talk among yourselves. No, you talk. You no, talk I'm just fine. <laughs> I obviously I can't talk. <laughs> base tags, base lags. Yeah. Base lags. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. You you can put it on all of us, Mag. You don't have to put it on just me. It's fine. Right, well, Lisa wanted to see. Okay. So I don't really want need to be in the spotlight here. Okay. There we go. Are you doing over there, Patty? I'm so we're just having you just sit there quietly. Oh, Julie's gonna get um, what? No. Where are you, Julie? Along with In the truck. She, Julie says I'm crafting a healthy soup for a cold night. Snow is coming. Where are you? I forget. I forget where she's, she is. She's in Julie. She's in. Oh, I don't know where she's at. And Lisa it, said, thanks, Maggie. Oh, you're welcome, Thank you, Lisa. Virginia. Thank you, Joanne. Thank you, ladies. This was yummy. Jason is chowing down on now. Roy crochets, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I would show you the needle, but it's, like, smaller than the, the head of a pin. It's so small you can't crazy. you can't even see the hook it's so small oh, <laughs> this is a size 14. minnesota oh yeah that's the vikings please hi louise hi louise bonjour louise Michelle, you look pretty clear. Let me put it on you for a minute and so everybody can see what you're doing. Pop an edge. There you are. Oh, no, you just went a little. We can see what you're doing. Yeah, Jaden's in the house now, so I'm sure my internet quality will go even lower. Yeah, you're a little um, pixelated. Yeah, so yeah. What are you make? What are you doing that new? You said you were gonna do something different. Or um, I'm trying. Uh, it's not really different. It's just like, like a, a three trifle pocket flippy thing, and then I want to do a something with my scraps of Manila envelope. So I'm gonna put some pockets down the side, and this will fit a page and the tags will slide out of the side nice that's I, I like your description a three pocket thingy thing yeah mm -hmm. you know everybody's doing the triple pocket yep so i'm joining and i need to use up this uh manila scrap and plus it will make a cool addition to the journal that i'm doing Very cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm I'm blurry. I can see me. You can take it off. Again. Yeah, I just put it back on all of us. How's the passenger doing, Patty? She's doing good. Yay. I did turn, yeah, and to answer Linda, I turned my camera off because um, 
we adopted a stray dog while we were in Texas. So we're bringing her home and she's got a really bad infection or something in her ear and she keeps digging at it and making it bleed. Uh-huh. So Aww. I'm just currently, yeah. So I'm just currently trying to keep her foot out of her ear until she falls asleep again. She's oh, down at the lake. She is. She, she's the best tempered, best natured. She really is a good dog. Really yeah. pretty. Donna said a few weeks ago I made two sock gnomes and a pumpkin out of splatter shields. Huh. Yeah, Donna, you need to post that picture in on Patty's page so everybody can see that. Because I saw those. I you sent it to me in a message. That's where you're supposed to share at. I need an X like right there. Is that center? Yes, that's center. Uh-uh. Yeah, hey, Maggie, if you would do yours up close. What's that? Oh, okay. Virginia's asking if you could put it on you for a few minutes so she can see what you're doing. Okay, I'm making a tag for a future journal. I made these two this morning on Michelle's channel. Yeah, we were were They were fun using Patty's um, copy dyed paper. Those are awesome. Background. So good. I added this little piece of lace afterwards to the top. Aww. Just for something oh, really different. pretty, Max. Thanks. Wow, Max, those look really nice. Thank you. Look at you go. <laughs> and if any of you don't know, Maggie has just finished her second um, journal. She used um, the, uh, what what does Patty call them, Mags? Foundation journals from Foundation. Patty. And she just put up a video. So you guys go over and check it out because she's Wait, doing really are good. With the they just have stuff. <laughs> What's that? I said we are over. They just have to click on it. Yeah. <laughs> we are over what? I missed it. You said you guys go over and check it out. I said we are over because we're on Maggie's channel. No, I mean go check out her video later. <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. I just got home. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> Leave me alone. Don't pick on me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just leave room. Go back to chatting. Virginia wants to know who's digital. Oh my gosh. Um, let's see. This is this is one of Tracy Fox. Stop the, laughing at me, Michelle. Chair. But these these aren't um, these aren't digitals. Really? Yeah. Yeah. The only digital is this photo. This image here. Nice. Those are really pretty. Everybody loves them, by the way. Angela's rolling on the floor laughing. What am I missing? She's probably laughing because you you told Michelle. She's laughing to leave you. you. <laughs> Don't pick on me. Because you yeah. said everybody, Maggie made these great journals from Patty's uh, foundation, foundation journal. Journals. You need to go over and check it out. And I said, we are over. Because <laughs> you're on Maggie's channel. Right. Whatever. So all you have to do is record your video now. <laughs> get it? I get it. Okay. <laughs> okay, y'all caught up. Whatever she No, I do not. <laughs> <laughs> Angela says she's going to be crafting along finally. <laughs> right, Michelle's a little loopy oh, tonight, I think. Right. <laughs> yeah, okay. So show us how you make a tag, Max. <laughs> okay, oh, that was a good I'll trick. Try. Was it? All right, so I just added these little pieces. I added this little, this is one of Tracy's too, this image here. And then these are just, were just like in my stash. And then 
I have this little rub on that I'm going to put on the side if I can get it up. Let me put those, move those over a little bit. And let's see where I'm going to put this. I think I'm going to put that right, right there. Find my popsicle stick. That's right. I've been at work. It takes me about an hour for my brain, you know, to chill. Oh my God, this takes me back to my scrapbooking days. That's right, everybody. Get those thumbs up. Let's go. I'm talking to the chat, if you don't mind. <laughs> Is this the new Laurel? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, I don't know what she just said. <laughs> no clue. Anyone want to describe for that one? You went wow. wrong. Isn't that how you hitchhike? Yes. Hitchhike? Yep, that is how you hitchhike. Okay. Which is now against the law, so don't okay, do it. Okay, so thumbs up. That's all. Right. the home. Oh Only goodness. thumbs up on the in the live chats, not anywhere else. It is against the law Fine. to do that now? Yes. Yes, ma'am. I did not know that. All right, let's see what else, because it still looks a little bare. What am I going to, maybe I'll just do some more inking. Inking, inking is always fun. When in doubt, ink. Oh, hi, Grace. Hi, hey, Grace. Hi, Grace, how are you? Sorry, I haven't been good that good tonight watching chat. I didn't see you come in. All right, Angela says, I'm going to try to get my 15 seconds of fame. How are you going to do that, Angela? I'm a little scared. Hi, Dawn. Hey, Dawn. Hi, Dawn. How are you? I actually, I oh, this that is so good. much better. Comes out like butter. See? Yeah, see? Nice job. Much, much better. We're all doing great, Grace. Awesome. Let's. See. Oh, I have. Yes, I do. Okay. Virginia says, Laurel, you may want to start a glass of wine tonight. I know you don't drink, but you may want you may want to relax. <laughs> yeah, I don't drink, Virginia. Hey, I'm relaxed. This is the quietest you've ever heard me. I'm doing my very best to just sit quietly, <laughs> which is really, really hard for me. Well, you don't have to do that, Laurel. Oh, I don't want to be crazed either. We love you just the way you are. We like the way you talk a lot. Yes then we don't have to talk as much. <laughs> it's calming. It's calming to us now. Yeah. 
If, if, if I started drinking, uh, Virginia, I would be a, on the floor and I would be somebody you don't know and I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, no drinking. Good night, Linda. Have a good night. Good night, Linda. Good night, Linda. I'm just putting some uh, more coffee paper on the back. Yes, I'm here, Dawn. Dawn's like, is Laurel there too? Yep, I'm here. She's here. She's tatting very quietly. Right, this is, when I'm tatting, I'm usually very quiet. <laughs> we have to tell her to open her eyes. This is like really, really thin French dictionary page. Let me tell you. Has your screen cleared up at all? I don't know. We can't see her. We can only see you right now. Oh. I look like perfect on StreamYard, but it's probably not. Jaden's on his thing, so. Oh, yeah, it's pretty cool with just the voice. All right, but I'll put it back so because when we're like this, it everybody can see what we're all doing, right? And we like seeing you, Michelle. We don't care that it's yeah. blurry, I can see exactly what you're doing. Yep, hey, Don, how are you doing? <laughs> you have ice cream, I have iced coffee sitting right next to me, like I need iced coffee with how hyper I am, but I'm a little bit calmer these days, trying to be at least. And you like your ice cream too. Yes, I do. I love my ice cream. Raspberry um, Angela, send me a message and let me know what you would like and I will tell you. Raspberry. Yeah, there's, there's four of us on Dawn. It's Maggie, Michelle Scott, me, and Patty Ling. You know, I could, I could probably, let me see here. I can't, I can't. I can do this. It might actually make it better. Let me there. see. Let me see what I can do. How long would it take or how long would it take? Yes, you're right. And I'm like confused. <laughs> oh, where's that doing anything but hmm. Patsy who's Patsy Angela no it's pasty like pasties oh my son oh. Pasty, yeah pasty yep that was my bad I'm gonna stop it's reading the chat now. <laughs> I can't talk I can't read <laughs> I give up. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna sit here and quietly craft. You guys speak over. Who's, who's, who's Patsy? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! You guys have the floor. <laughs> that was. <laughs> They're laughing at me, Jim. Oh. <laughs> that was you, Maggie, talking to you, by the way. <laughs> she said that was, I think that was like, <laughs> you're laughing at me, Jim. He's ignoring us. <laughs> I don't blame him. <laughs> He's very focused. <laughs> 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 
I'm going to, I'm going to go out for a second. So watch <laughs> for me to come back, Max. I got to fix something with my webcam. So I'll be right back. All right. Okay. So I'm going to go out and I'll just look for me down in the, you know, background. I'll try. Don't okay. ever hang my bed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, Hi, Grace. Jennifer Jane. Hey, Grace. Oh, hey, good night, Grace. <laughs> Hi, Jennifer. All right. Okay, that's it. I'm leaving this bottle upside down. Did it work though, right? The, uh, oh yeah. Did it know? Nice. It's just taking a long. I just probably should pour the rest of my other bottle in here, and I can, you know, stop complaining about it. But I'm just mm -hmm. gonna leave it upside down. That way, it's ready to go. Good night, Julia. Oh, good night, Julia. See Julia. She is in Alaska, right? I have no I'm idea. I'm gonna say I think yeah, so. she's in Alaska. What happened? Oh, Laurel's two... back. Oh. Laurel. We should have come in with a disclaimer tonight. Oh. We needed a disclaimer tonight. Pardon us, yeah. we're all new. <laughs> oh, that's right, Laurel. I was supposed to be watching for her. Well, I, all of a sudden, I looked at the chat and it said, I'm backstage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. You guys shouldn't really rely on me to see anything. <laughs> <laughs> Not to be a complete brat, it is highly entertaining, though. It is. I admit it. What are you, what are you gonna do when my vision returns? <laughs> well, we'll have to find something else to amuse ourselves. <laughs> I'm gonna mess with you and sit beside a mirror. There you go. <laughs> so you see two of me. Like Michelle. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I'm coming back. Exactly. Don says, watch it at your own risk. Yep. <laughs> you never know what's going to be said or red or, you know, or red or. <laughs> oh, I like it zoomed in, Laurel. Good job. Yeah, that's what I went to so I could yeah. zoom it. Yeah, they can see you really well. Nice. I figure I'm working on something so small. <laughs> Might as well zoom in a bit. Right? Now I just need my chair to go higher, which it won't. I need to, like, put 10 cushions on it or something. Do they make, like, office chairs that go extra tall for the vertically challenged folks? Uh, I think they do make some that go taller. And I don't yeah, they do. They go up and down. No. <laughs> well, they do. I had one, and there was a lever, and it, it either. <laughs> You're not helping yourself, Mag. What? <laughs> How am I supposed to craft? <laughs> oh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no more. <laughs> yep, that one went right over Mag Mag's head this time, not mine. 
Yeah, it did. I have no idea why you're laughing. <laughs> oh, my word. Think of the conversation earlier. Uh, you mean before we went live? Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, God. Thank God I can do this with my eyes closed. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh. All right, now it's too quiet. My husband's looking over. Me. I shouldn't tell you. She's up down with any right. Oh my! Are you crafting, Angela? I think she was gonna. She's probably laughing, and he's that looking she over at her. She wasn't what crafting. She's that she was laughing. So right. He's wondering what she was laughing at. She's they're saying, all my stars are all my days. Yep. All my stars are yep. all my days. New bag. Yep, she's laughing. So I have to do a birdie. Oh my God, now I can't talk. <laughs> I have to do a Brit. I have to do a Brit. No, I have to do a bit of bragging. Did you all see the picture I posted of Kalia? I did. She oh is my adorable. God. Yes. Oh my goodness, that child. Holy cow. She just gets more beautiful every day. She does. She is gorgeous. So good, I man. I was just like, oh my goodness. And that curly hair. Oh, the hair, the way Dream did it today. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> Where did you post it? Loved it. On my Facebook. On her <clears throat> Facebook. Okay. I've had, I've had no internet, no cell phone oh. for four days. So I'm, like, way, way behind. So I need to know where to go look for it when I get home. Yeah, it's, it's on my Facebook page. She's so using it with me, so... <laughs> oh my god, Angela. Oh, she's too funny. She's too funny. Too funny. Let's see. I think this has to be 21. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 12, 14, I don't know what pink is in here, but. Oh, thank you, Angela. Isn't she? Those eyes, man. Her eyes, her lips, her hair. <laughs> she just, oh my God. I told Dream she needs to put her in some kind of kid modeling. Right. She's got the personality yeah. for it, for sure. <clears throat> I saw that today on Snapchat, and I'm like, oh, my God, i got to share this picture.
everybody's so busy. Concentrate, man. Concentrate. Yeah, we're all crafting. Isn't that what we're supposed to be doing? Yep. Hey, Scotty, can you remind me when to put the uh, game on? 820 mags. I know I'm going to forget. I believe it's 820 tonight. It should be yeah, like a Tuesday so. night, right? But it's like Thursday. So I think they're all at 820. I don't know. Let me yeah. see if I can 820 or 8, 830. Go look in the book real quick. It confirms the book. Hey, Jay. Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Well, we're I'm, working. Well, let's see. I'm about to um, be hitting a dead zone. Okay. And so, what do you want to tell so us about? So, I'm going to go ahead and leave. If you guys. Huh? I'm saying I'm going to go ahead and leave before I hit the dead zone and it just kicks me out. Okay. Okay. You're going to come back on when you get home or? Oh, you got to take care of the dog. Yeah, it huh? just depends on how long. It is. All right, yeah. no worries. I got to do, do a meet and greet. Like so, okay. we'll just see how yeah, we'll just see how long you guys are on and stuff. Otherwise, I'll just catch up with you guys later. Okay, have okay. a safe rest of your trip. Bye, Lang. All right. Yeah, be careful. All right. Good night. Hey, you Roger that. Yep. Say good, good night. Good night. <laughs> Bye, you guys. Bye. Bye. Lang out. <laughs> Oh, good night, Dawn. Good night, Dawn. Thank you for coming good night, in. Dawn. Um, it's eight twenty at eight twenty, Maggie. Oh, good. Okay. I didn't realize it was a home go. game for you. What's that? It's a home game for you. Yep, home game. Hmm. Wow, it just went like totally silent. <laughs> I know. Jeez. Everybody's concentrating. Come on. Now. There you go, Laurel. Talk while you crash. <laughs> right. Talk to my thread. I don't right? want to do that. I want to put that over here. Right. I don't want to do that. It's like I get going. It's like I just want to see the end of it. I want to get to the end of the strip. So I'm always counting like how many more I have left to go. <laughs> it's got to be gratifying for sure. It is. You really put a lot of. Well, it seems like a lot of work to me, but you make it look super, super easy. I know she does, doesn't she? Yeah, like I, it. She makes me feel like I can do it, but yeah, no, no I can't do it. Not gonna happen. Not, not in this lifetime. Kim says it's been silent. You guys are busy. Concentrate, Kim. Concentrate. No, I don't know why we're so quiet. I don't know either. Other. All right. So one, one more day. Going. One more day, and then I have a three-day weekend. Woohoo! Nice. Hey, do we have a three-day weekend? Yeah. What, what, what you got going on? Yeah, Mondays. And I get Mondays, paid. Columbus Day. Yes, Columbus Day, and I get paid. No, oh, I'm chatting, Kim. Hey, Jaden. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, that's maybe okay. We should, maybe we should go live I'll Monday morning. <clears throat> oh, no, you'll be getting ready for No, you're also. okay. No, we'll have to do it over the weekend. Yeah, it's a long weekend, Kim. She's saying no, it isn't. Or oh, unless she's talking about something else. 
No, she was saying, is that crochet? And then she said, no, it isn't. No, oh, it's not. oh, no, that's tatting. That's, it's beautiful. I love it with the little beads. All right, so in here, where's my paper? Jay must have forgot to tell her that they don't have school Monday. <laughs> I don't know. He's looking right now. Donna, do we have school Monday? She's no, it's a national holiday. Yes, yeah, it's, it's national holiday. It's Columbus Day. There's no school. Thank you, Kim. I'm thinking we get President's Day off and not Columbus Day. No, you get Columbus Day off. Yeah, it's a national. It's not a state holiday. Where's Donna at? She, she in a chat. Yeah. Huh? I do. You have Monday off? No. No? Nope. It's a national holiday. How can you not have yeah, Monday Yeah, how off? can you not have it off? Are you sure you read that right? Yep. Well, then that suck. That doesn't make That's... sense. It's a national holiday. Yeah, it's I national. How, I don't know how we can't have it off. Hold on, let me go look. He read it wrong. He had yeah. Look. Yeah, he's pulling your leg like he did that one night with the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and she did not like that. Oh, thank you, Kim. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Thank you. How are you doing, Debbie? You've been busy making gorgeous projects lately, too. But you're always, you, I don't know, you cr can crank out some projects for sure. I know she can, right? God. Okay. She had a good, I think she had a good idea going, too. Um, she was having her subscribers, um, Give ideas of what yeah, to make. I saw that. Yeah, that's a good idea. She also did um, a thing for BB Crafts. She was making little um, bead dangles. I watched oh. the video. Yeah, I'm behind on videos, Debbie. I'm trying to catch up, but I can only watch for so long until uh, my eyesight returns to normal. Yeah, it does make it easier. I know, didn't I, Kim? Yeah, I can. I can pretty much whip through this really fast now. I I don't know. I like. I, I can almost do it with my eyes closed. That's why I said I need to start challenging myself a little more now and start adding a second row. Yeah, but, but those. These, I think that's. These are so much so fun to make, though. These ones. Yeah. It's just pretty the way it is. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm not going to add a second row onto these. I'm going to do different ones. No, I know, but I'm just saying I like and stuff. the way that, you know, that is the pattern for that. Right. Yeah, I don't know. See, that what Debbie's doing, That that's almost to me like... Being on a design team, if people gave me suggestions, then I'd be like under pressure, like, oh, my God, <laughs> now, now I got to create this thing. You know, yeah. I don't know if I could do it like that, but I mean, it is a good idea. Yeah. Oh, Debbie says her son has school on Monday, too. Dawn oh. is saying it says Columbus Day, but um, it doesn't say that there's no school. Really? That's, I thought the whole, I thought everybody yeah, had it off. off either. We got, we have Friday off. That's so weird. We now, why Friday do you have off Friday off? For a teacher in service day. Now, you mean tomorrow or next Friday? Next Friday. Oh. 
Next Friday, we have off. Well, if I was going to do that, I should have used the heavier wow. paper, Michelle. Yeah, so next Friday we have off, not Monday. So we'll get, we'll still get a three-day weekend, but it'll just be. Right. I the whole three-day weekend. Country had it off, all the schools. So did I. Well, it used to be that way. Well, it used to be they used, um, there were two Mondays in a row for holidays um, in October. And then they just put it one. I think it's President's Day now. They used to be, is it President's Day? I forget. No, no it is Columbus Day. President's Day is in February. Right. Um, but there were two in, I know there were two in October. And then they changed it to just one. I, I'm pretty sure I could. Who knows? I could be wrong. I'm going to sew really quick. Tell me if it's loud. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, I knocked over my jersey. Ah. I think Debbie said the banks and post office are closed, though. Yeah. Yeah. Of course they are. All right. Let's see. That book is dry. That's going to be too. What stitch am I on? A straight stitch. Yes, that's what I want to be on. Loud? Nope. No, that's not bad. All right. Did I hear that? That was my thread breaking. Uh oh. No. Pete's sake. For crying out loud. What's the deal? <laughs> 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 One's for Pete's sake, for crying out loud, jeepers. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Roy says, there's a great controversy around Columbus Day. Folk are uh, objecting to it because of the treatment Columbus and the sailors treated and took advantage of the indigenous people on the islands. Well, oh, jeez. Hi, Lily. She's... From Australia. Welcome. Hi, Lily. Welcome. Hi, Lily. I think that's kind of crazy. I mean, after what? How many years? Yeah, it's always something. Come on now. Yeah. You got to find something to, you know what about. Right. Well, there's no proofreading needed here, Roy. We we we're all good at decoding and stuff. Yep. We got it. It says this is not fun. I need help. Not one inch is clean yet. I put out too much when I made a make a journal. Come over, please. That's Virginia. I'm right there with you. I don't think I have Virginia, a little bit of everything here. Virginia, you need to go watch my Mojo video and make a mood board. That's right. Yes. Will make you only use what you have. Go watch Lily that. Says, Not Lily right says, now. Thank you. Thank you all. Love your work to bits. I'm guessing. Oh, she's thanks, thank you. Really. Your work, Max. What's that? I'm guessing she's saying she loves your work. I think she's saying that about all of us. But she came in here so i'm guessing she's watched some of your stuff before you know what i'm saying hopefully yep that's nice of you to say yeah i'm gonna try to go on live more now 
I feel more comfortable now. We'll call her the one-eyed crafter. Yeah. Ah, yeah, that. yeah, thanks for that moniker. <laughs> oh, no. Pun intended. Pun intended. <laughs> Before you start saying anything. <laughs> the one I'd craft her patch. It's, you know. it's, yeah, hopefully it's temporary. <laughs> yes, definitely temporary. Because if it isn't, I'm going to, I'm going to go insane. <laughs> we'll, we'll be right there with you, man. Yes, I know you will. Okay. Because I'll be taking, I'll be taking you with me. Can I make some more mistakes, please? Because I just haven't had enough tonight. Oh, what you do? Goodness, I am just she what started on the wrong do? side or something. Uh, One, two, three, four. You would think that I've never done this in my life. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. What do we appreciate <laughs> four more to go. Oh, have a good I, night, Roy. I think um, Roy has to go. What? I think oh, Roy has to go, so I was telling him have a good night. No, he's he said no? good day. He said good day to Lily. Oh, okay. to Lily. Oh, oh you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Not oh, my good night. Goodness. See, this is this is why I said I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh my God. Virginia said, after I find my desk and table, I will go look, Michelle. And Lily said, this is where I'm getting courage to make doily and lace books. See, I'm watching you, Max. Oh. You can do it, Lily. You can do it. Yes, you can. If I can do it, you can do it. And she has specific videos out there that go page by page and tell you exactly what you need to do to get started and get going and make one. You can do it. Yes, you can. You can do it. I just put pages together, but I got to find images so I can start it. Michelle sent me some perfect size doilies to make a new mini. I can't wait to see it. I need mm -hmm. to figure out what I want to do for a theme, though, you know, for images. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. I've done too many fairy ones now. <laughs> so I got to think of something different. Have you ever done a botanical one? I I did. Um, the one I did for uh, Shelly, that didn't have um, people images on it. Wasn't that botanical? I, I, think, I think so. I did one for Shelly because Shelly said one day um, something about making a, a doily book, but without, you know, people, you know, women, w girls, whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and so I made one for her with, um, I think it was botanical though. Cause I don't, I don't know what else it, I would have done that was non image type. Bootsy, I can speak Australian too. Good day, mate. Crikey. Uh, <laughs> don't let me get Jaden in here. That is his favorite accent. <laughs> oh my God. I every time the Geico commercial comes on, I sit there and try and repeat what the little gecko is saying. <laughs> he will he'll still be talking and I'm like, okay, you can stop now. And he's like, I'm still in character. I'd like he just, oh, um, I can't. Like to, I can't do. Um, Kim would like to know if you're going to be doing it live, Mags, a tutorial. Um, I will. I can do it live. I mean, you don't need me. You don't, didn't need to see me put the pages together because I always, I do those, you know, the same way every time anyway. But yeah, I can do that live. Now that I feel yeah. better. I need to make a couple of smaller tags for the pockets. I need. 
Okay, this is just not working out. Let me go look. There's only one other place I could be. I say that. <laughs> right. That would be in here. When you get a chance, why don't you ladies um, put something in the chat? So in case anybody, I think Lily might be saying she does. She's not sure who Laurel and Michelle are. So that way there she can always go to your channel and oh, okay. check you out. Just when you get a chance. I'll do that in just one second. No hurry. Uno momento. Lily, you'll learn who I am really quick because my life revolves around the color purple. So you'll it you'll is. learn that very quickly. <laughs> it it does. Very much so. Oh, what? I guess I can't. Oh, my word. Are you having troubles, Michelle? I didn't make a mood board. <laughs> Getting too much stuff out. All right, here we go. I'm looking for coin envelopes. That's what I need is coin envelopes. Where are my coin envelopes? Um, All right. So how is this for, you know, yep, doing, like a flip out, doing a flip out? There you go. Yeah, I like that, Mags. And then That's you know, cute. put some tags in there. Love it. I, I feel like I haven't crafted in forever. Seriously. Me too. There's yes, one. it is really. It's uh, it's also very, very tranquil and supposed to be, you know, like peace and stuff, which I need in my life because I run about nine million miles an hour. Oh, I guess Kim was guessing what I was making. Yeah, this is just one of those uh, legal size envelopes that I folded in half and then, let's wait a minute, I have another one here. See, just legal size. And then you fold it in half and then what I'll do is on one of my journal pages, my next journal maybe, I'll just glue this down and then on a page and then you can flip it out. Yep. I do, I, I can't get away from using images though. You know what I mean? Thanks, Virginia. I just love using, and I love Tracy's images from that um, kit. Well, that's part of your signature, Mags, is you always use images, you know? That's part of you. Yeah, like I like when, I'd like when somebody, you know, sees something and says, oh, you know, you can tell Maggie made that. Right. Thank you, Laurel and Michelle. I will definitely visit after tags are my oh, oh, thank you, Lily. Um thank you, Lily. And and mine is always I always like to make minute, tiny, detailed, annoy you kind of things. <laughs> if it's not a challenge, I don't want to do it. If it doesn't take me forever, I don't want to do it. Mine's grungy, Lily. Yes, Michelle makes amazing tones, Lily. She does. All her journals are amazing. Oh, yes, they are. I have to get one one of these days. Maybe you will. No, I was sitting thinking the other day about what I got to make everybody for Christmas, which I need to start doing like today <laughs> you know it'll be here before i know it 
I got uh, I think four ready to go up. Oh, really? Yeah, really? Yeah. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, seven. Been keeping it on the DL. Well, you have. Yeah, that's most the first of we're women. hearing of it. Most of them are women. She likes fairies and yes, mostly ladies and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. All right. I think I'm going to do one where you can flip it out. Oh, I bet it's absolutely gorgeous there. But you know why I won't go there, Lily? I have a map. <laughs> and it's got little <laughs> in it of all the places I won't go because of the spiders. <laughs> oh, my word. And I'm sorry. I would literally have a real-life heart attack if I ran into one of them in Australia. <laughs> I really would. I am that deathly afraid of spiders. And all... The last three weeks, it's been nothing but spider phobia, and they've been everywhere. I found the row, the perfect, perfect purple house. She texts me back and says, nope, can't do it. There's trees over it. There's spiders. Yeah, I'm like, right. are you right now? I want no trees around my house. There can be She's no like, trees. Nope, nope, too close to trees. I'm like, oh my goodness. And it's this beautiful purple house. She's like, nope, not going to do it. Like, oh, I'm surprised God. she goes out of her house. There's spiders everywhere. I hate to tell you that. Laurel. And I'm looking for them all the time, but I will not walk under a tree ever. I don't walk under trees. I know what hangs in them. I've seen it. <laughs> Have you ever heard that saying about spiders, Laurel? No, what? Maybe I shouldn't tell you because I don't want you to be scared. Oh my God, what's the saying? That we swallow eight spiders a year. I have swallowed a spider in my life. No, I remember. That you are always within six foot of a spider. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Michelle. Thanks for that info. Always. She said you wouldn't like it. <laughs> I gave you the oh. Lily says, I understand the detail work. That's my kind of language. I've been making assemblage jewelry with antique pieces for a long time. Started adding antique and vintage laces and it evolved oh i am came to youtube do you have you this is your youtube channel right lily because i am going to check it out i also I just went and subscribed i make jewelry i tat i crochet i do mixed media um i do quilling i draw i do a bit of everything there's nothing you don't do let just put it that way right but yeah, that'd be awesome. And you've come to the right place because all these ladies have gorgeous laces and stuff. Let me go. I got to go to her channel real quick and subscribe. Ooh. Oh, I'm already subscribed to you, Lily. Hey, and I have the bell on. So I'm going to definitely check it out after this. You're too scared to put up work. No, 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 no. There's no such thing. Hi, Susan. Hi, Susan. Hey, Susan. She says she's about to wet herself. Thanks, Michelle. Thanks for the info. Hey, look <laughs> it up. Google it. Google it. Well, do you also know that they say you, you swallow at least eight spiders in your life? I would believe it because, you know... Oh, I think Lily. Yeah, I don't even think about it. Fly up in your face and yeah, she said she came to YouTube and fell in love with you girls. Aw. Oh, that's sweet. Um, yes, I have Lily. I've been on with Marlene. Yep. Hi, Susan. How are you doing? Yeah, you definitely can't be afraid to show your work because. I mean, there's too many people yeah. out there that make amazing things that are too scared to share. And we definitely, I would definitely like to see what you're making. Absolutely. I mean, even if you start by posting it in some of the groups, just posting pictures, I'm telling you, people will want to see. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, I'm never definitely afraid of them. You work, never, ever be scared to go live. It's so much fun you can talk 
you can make mistakes like me. You can pretty much be totally unprepared like me. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm never, I'm never prepared. I recognize my love point. Not to do, but you know, who cares? Right. I'm having fun and I like it. Yep. Donna, I agree because they always are like right at your face when you bump into one. Yeah, I have one of those unforgettable voices, Lily. It's always loud and obnoxious most of the time. Oh, will you stop? I am You're not I'm loud and obnoxious. A lot. I just like to talk. And nothing wrong with that. We're okay no. with that. Well, thanks, Lily. She says she's overwhelmed by the gorgeousness of the work. Well, oh, I have to mute for one minute. Okay. Lily. Her daughter. Oops. Okay. So if that's not going to work out. Plan B. Plan B. Yeah, I don't think I have one, but you know, we can always give it a shot. That's the one that opens. That was the other thing. It's too big. Okay. Boy, bay. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Lily was laughing that with, about Laurel and the spiders. <laughs> Donna went to go to the restroom at work the other day. Uh, yeah, spider on the door. I almost out my hand on it. Talk about a freak out moment. Oh, I bet. Yeah, Donna doesn't. Uh... My daughter actually has a phobia. She goes insane. They don't bother me. I'm used. I'm used to them because you know, being downstairs, um, I get there's spiders down here all the time, and I and I have you know all the uh, conservation woods behind me. So I um I don't mind them. I just don't like it when they startle me, and I'm yeah. Like, you know, and, and I, I get over that first initial, and then I'm like, okay, where's my rag? Because you're about to go. Yeah, and I don't think Massachusetts has any um, poisonous spiders. I don't think. I mean, I've been it. bit before. I, I got bit once, and it, it did turn into um, an infection, but that, but it, you know, wasn't like poisonous i must have just had a reaction to it okay i'm back sorry about that how's cam doing good yeah i just don't like that they sneak up on you like you turn and there they are right at your face i'm, I'm and i have a thing with things that crawl like the way a spider crawls like how a crab crawls you know how you have things with frogs you know, legs, Michelle. Yeah, the bones go the wrong it's, way. To me, it's how they look when they sit and move, how their legs move and stuff. Just like a crab, it just creeps me out. Don't like it. All those jumping spiders. Yeah, yeah, no thanks. Uh, yeah. I watched this video the other day. I think it was on Facebook, and it says this woman relaxed by letting spiders walk on her face and she had like this spider that was probably as big as my hand just crawling around no her face. no 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 
And that's how she relaxed is when she comes home from work. And she did like the video and she had probably, oh, I don't know, six or seven different spiders just walking all over her face. And she was just quiet, quietly sitting there while it was walking on her well, face. Well, you know why? She has to quietly sit there or they would bite her. <laughs> I don't think she lets like poisonous ones walk on her, but they were not pretty. That's for sure. That one big one was Susan. Sa Susan says, "Oh, and those jumping spiders. Florida has huge brown jumpers, but not poisonous." Oh yeah, my 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 daughter sent me some pictures of some she killed. But... I lived in Florida for twenty years, and thank goodness I only had like one issue one time with a spider and it was, I was sitting in the living room and I kept hearing this scratching noise. And I was like, what the heck is that? And I couldn't find it, couldn't find it. And the sound finally led me into the bathroom. And I'm like, it was like coming from the bathtub and I'm like, what the heck? And there was a house spider and they're like about this big. And yeah, okay, I'll it was trying to crawl out of the bathtub and it was making a sound and i was like oh, okay yeah no thanks uh, i'll pass yep yeah that was not fun i was like yep you're gonna go <laughs> gotta go and i'm sorry and i know i want to say gina and i don't know why i get <coughs> I either gina or dawn i always get confused lisa. or lee see now i'm still wrong i why do i it's i know lisa. her name i don't know why i do that Hi, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Yeah, I just do not like spiders. And those crab spiders that I saw in Florida. Yeah, those are harmless. That have that hard shell with these pokey things sticking out of it, almost like they belong in the dinosaur age. But the web <laughs> they make are insane. It looks like a big star. Yes, Lisa. I, and I know that. I don't know. I don't know what my issue is. Yeah, that's Lisa. I'm having an issue with names lately <laughs> for some reason. I always have an issue with oh. names. I wish everybody on YouTube had to use their name. <laughs> <laughs> and then you don't ever have to worry about remembering. Yeah, I like that a lot of them are actually adding the name in the title, kind of like how mine is. Yeah, yeah. It does make it easier to remember. Hold on. Mine's pretty straightforward. Uh, What's up, Michelle? I said mine's pretty straightforward. Been been that my whole life. Yeah, me too. I was thinking of um, adding like something, but I never could figure out what I wanted to, wanted to, so I just left it. Yeah, I actually sat one night watching a spider make a web, and it took forty five minutes. That part's cool. I just don't like the spider end of it, you know, and I don't like webs on me either. Oh, my bad one. <laughs> no, no. Do you guys want to know how? Well, maybe I better not because we're on live, Shell. <laughs> hey, Shell. Hey, Shell. She said, How's everybody? Good. Good. How are you? Good. She's good. Roy says, with my personalities, I'd have to change my name to Sybil. <laughs> <laughs> I actually loved that movie when I was a kid. <laughs> I like that. Uh... Right, you need to be up here. I need you closer. There we go. Hmm. All right. 
you on the inside here. Look at this piece. How cool is that? Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Love them. Love that. I need about a million more. Nice. Is that the Lang? That's a Lang. This has got to be the mellowest live of us all together. I know, I right? And it's not even, it, it's Thursday night. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with that? What's up with that? I don't know. I'm concentrating. I should have picked something easier, and I'm just making a like double pocket thingy well you have to concentrate i remember that last trifold thing you made live and you kept making errors and errors and errors <laughs> oh that thing was horrible i have that i kept it for a giveaway and i still haven't given it away i have a giveaway pile <laughs> i'm like man oh she's you showing you a coffee dyed paper kim from maddie from patty I cannot speak either tonight. Oh, have oh fun, yeah. Roy. You answering, Kim? Yeah. Roy says it's choir time. La, 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 la. Yeah. Oh, I, have fun, Roy. Have fun, Roy. Enjoy. Thanks yeah, enjoy coming. it. Always a pleasure. I've always loved watching you girls create. Just love artists work at work. Does Oh, we're all the same way. Yep. I love watching other people live create things. Yep. <coughs> Let's see. Might want to uh, and I love learning new things, so I think that's why. There's always something out there to learn. All right. I'm done with you. Or tips and tricks, you know, that you can learn from uh, other artists. That's the coolest part. Yep. I like, um, like that one time I um, did my altered cigar box and I did it live and some of the ideas that I would have not even thought of and it was like a group project with the chat. I'm telling you, that was yep. so fun. Even that painting project. Remember that, Laurel? Oh my God, that was so much fun. That and yes, so the ideas that everybody show. had. That I had the best idea when I told you to do it the other how, way. <laughs> how did I, did I miss the right? painting one? I don't remember that. It was my DIY um, chalk paint. It was so good. Um, okay, I missed that. How did I miss it? Because I couldn't keep up with chat. So um, she came in and I got so much help from everybody watching. It's, I love that part of this. If I get stuck, I'll be like, mm, should I do that? Should I do this? And then you'll, there'll just be an off the wall thing come in, and I'm like, oh my God, that's brilliant. Yes. Totally love it. Right, Lily? She said, it's amazing the tips and tricks that she's learned. You get so much inspiration on YouTube, you really do. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it can be overwhelming. Yes, yeah. Because like, 
I've been I've been on it'll be three years on Christmas Eve will be my third year anniversary on YouTube and when I first started getting like if you go back to my earlier videos they're all like shabby chic and wall hangings and pushing like the me? bar with, <laughs> yeah pushing yeah. the bar with different textures and fabrics and stuff like that and then I got into paper crafting so I was obsessed with watching all these videos and oh I wanted it to look like this and that and this and that and then you know you realize that maybe I need to back away from the YouTube and make my own style and yeah so I cut back on the videos that I was watching because it, it was, was like overload sensory yeah overload. it was like sensory overload and it, you just have to disconnect and find your own aesthetic and then yeah go with that because you know you can look at something like you said you know it's a that's a you know made by maggie white and everybody knows what a tracy fox looks like in a a wendy or a gail and you right know, you have to find your own aesthetic and then they think that if they don't do it as good as those girls that they don't need to post it and they and, get yeah they get discouraged and that you shouldn't because you know your art is your art and if it makes you feel good i think you should post it that's right because yeah. someone may learn something from your art that you don't think they could because you don't share it but there is exactly. so much to learn from everyone there is oh, good night, Debbie. So oh, from even the way from somebody gluing something down versus, you know, how I glue something down, you know, I was just like, oh, goodness. You know, I didn't even think about that. Like Tracy Fox. Here's a good example. She, uh, I use cheesecloth a lot and so does she. And um, she glues her her cheesecloth different than I do, and her way is actually easier than my way. Uh, uh -huh. nothing. Go ahead, keep going. Um, her way is actually easier than my way, and I was like, Ugh. you know, cool. I'm glad that she shared that. You know, I remember she was really weary of you know coming on and and sharing and stuff, but it's really. Yes, Lily says, you just described me, overwhelming. I see new ways and different fabric, fabrics, new and so full on, overwhelmed, right. That's when you have to step back, do your thing, and then go there for tips and ideas yep. and stuff. Totally. Like, right. Lily, most of, most of my subscriptions now, you'd be surprised. It's not very many journal journalers because it confuses me and it, it makes me... Um, almost forget about right. your own creativity my own creativity and who i am and what i want to bring to the table and stuff so i watch like you know silly videos like i love watching like abandoned building cures and just weird things you know people who garbage pick i think that's fun um just just cool things just you sometimes you just have to just step back and disconnect and find your own aesthetic for sure that's going to look very very cool and hi general. rose hi you guys must have not heard me <laughs> yeah i just say it loud enough how you doing rosie hi, hi rosie Lorna. Hey, Lorna. How are you doing, Lorna? There's another amazing person, Lily, right there. Yeah, Lorna. Yeah, Her journals are amazing. Oh, Is it one of the cats? Yeah. All right, everybody stop talking at once or what? Well, now I'm just checking the uh, chat to make sure oh. I didn't miss somebody. I know Debbie left. I didn't see one, but bye Debbie. Yeah. And I bye did Debbie. say goodbye to her. I'm pulling out the fox. Oh, 
and two more and then I'm done. Oh, she just got up from a nap. And Lily says she loves the junk, junk hunters. Yeah, and those, um, you know who I really love watching? Crazy Lamp Lady. I love her. Her name is Crazy. Jocelyn. Yeah, Crazy Lamp Lady. And she... Oh, I, I, I think you mentioned her to me once. And did. I did go and check yeah. out her channel. And she posts, like, a lot. So she keeps me pretty busy. And it, you know, takes my mind off of, you know of other things and yep. stuff like that. When that happens to me, I go back to my crochet and I go watching, you know, like that new crochet I'm doing. I always tend to go back to that. That keeps me a little grounded and gets my brain back to where it's supposed to be for some reason. Oh, good, Lorna. She finally has her furnace working again Yay. after 12 days. Oh, my, oh goodness. my goodness. And, you know, she's in snow country. Oh, yeah, she's up there. Just some transparencies. Cranking it out here. Cranking it out. Almost done. Oh, she was playing with the two-year-old all morning. Wore out. And Lily says she's heard of the crazy lamp lady. I love the crazy lamp lady. She's so much fun. And, like, you you just have to just silly things and um i watch a lot of documentaries on youtube i watch one on the bronte sisters with this british lady and it was the most fascinating documentary i've ever seen <laughs> i was like yeah. wow I, she didn't, was I didn't see you so i don't think i said hi <laughs> i know you've been here but i didn't see you so who's that you're talking about uh, Louise. Oh, Louise. Yeah. Yes, we said bonjour. Oh, that's right. You did. I remember. Maybe I did say hi. <laughs> and I already forgot. <laughs> that would be me. I just need my brain back. That's all. I'll be good. <laughs> Give my brain oh, back. Did you sleep better last night? Mm, a little bit. A little bit? Just fabric scissors around me. I'm like, oh, I can't do that. Okay, Liz to... said she saw a Bronte doc. Anybody yeah, it's a, um, I can look it up really quick. It is amazing, and this lady does it, and it's oh, and she talks about you get to see the letters that they wrote and where they lived, and they had a brother. Did anyone know they had a brother? And Hi, Sherry. Awesome. Hi, Sherry. Lorna, well, this is just coffee dyed paper. Patty's coffee dyed paper. There's different. Um, whoops. Sorry. Just hit my camera. I love her coffee dyed paper. I don't, I've never had the birch. Is it birch bark paper? Yeah, Lorna said, what are you using, Maggie? Looks like birch bark paper. Did you do you have any of that, Michelle? No. No. But did Patty have that one time? Birch bark? Does he yeah, bark? it sounds familiar. I know she had that birch bark stuff that yeah, the I think was it paper? Yeah, it was a, a painting on it. 
Yeah. Oh, right. Right. That's right. <laughs> what? I've got nine million pairs of scissors around me, Michelle. Just well, you can't board. find one that's not. <laughs> Flip and pick one. Oh, my word. It was so funny when my mom came to visit. She needed scissors and she goes, okay, which ones am I allowed to use? Jaden's like, blue handle only. <laughs> right. Yep. Blue handle only. Kim says it looks like so much more like it looks so good. Yeah, your little things are awesome. I love them. You're really getting this paper thing. I'm so glad you tried it. Oh, thanks. I remember when um, I picked up my scissors and I started cutting paper and I looked down and I realized they were my fabric scissors. Uh, uh, I would have so I, like, I bought a new pair. Oh my God. Seriously? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I did. And um, now I yeah. keep them where I can't, they're not even in reach. I have to go actually get them so that I don't do it. Cause they're those, um, the German, uh, the German ones that Joanne's has. Um, trying to think, they're really heavy, and they're they're the one with the black handles. Um, let me see. No, because now I'm curious. No, they're all like they're all metal. I think it's just silver. all over. Yeah, but, yeah. they're see super heavy. Name. These here. Yeah, they're really yeah, heavy. Buddy. Those are nice. Yeah, you. I lucked out. I had a sixty percent off coupon that day. You know, they have sixty percent off, like once a year or something. I think I only paid like twenty dollars for them. I have three pairs of fabric scissors, and then I have one that's only for cutting um, tape things like score tape, and then the rest are yeah. paper. But my three fabric scissors are like intense. They're all like the Fiskars, and the ones will like cut your finger off and they weigh like 50 pounds yeah so those, the ones i just showed you i think those slide, are probably fingers slide through that fabric like butter yep uh let's see kim Lorel, what will you be doing with that she wants to know um i am uh gonna be selling tatting kim i i have an order going on but I, it's to go up the side of a page in a journal or, or whatever else you want to do with it. I just think the I'm making them in like eight or nine inch strips. I just think it works better that way than a big long piece. Okay. And Lily wants to know, and Michelle, maybe you can answer this one. Is there a way to soften well, crunchy sound of coffee tea papers a bit? All dyed papers seem too crispy. Is there a way to what now? I'm sorry. Soften, soften them. Crunchy the crunchy sound of the coffee, you know, and tea dyed papers. Uh, just exactly what Susan said. I have some of it right here. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. That's further down. You could add a few drops of glycerin to the water. Yeah. You can add some glycerin to your water. And if you've already made them or you purchased them from somebody, put some of this in a spray bottle. And just give it a couple of spritz on your um, tea dyed paper, and this will um, 
soften it up for you. This is what I use to break up like a heavy, not a heavy chipboard, that we'll say like a medium chipboard, like um, a little bit thicker than a cereal box. And I'll smother it pretty much in this glycerin and to where it becomes malleable and you can roll it in a ball and then you flatten it out and you let it dry. And when it dries, it looks like leather. It's a fake way of getting leather. That was my whole intention of getting this glycerin. It, it makes your paper very workable. You can't like, don't like manhandle it or anything, but it makes it very, very workable. And um, that's what I use mine for is to make uh, journals look like leather. Yeah, I didn't know you could put that right on paper. You sure can. Put it in the spray bottle. Add a little water with it. Not too much. You don't need you don't need a lot of the glycerin either. Just enough that'll break down the fibers. Oh, she has glycerin too. She said I do my own papers. Thank you. You're very welcome. Susan said glycerin's water loving hydrophilic it will hold water forever oh mm -hmm. yep it says warning do not it's, uh, it's a, it says it's a, a soothing and moisturizing agent for creams and lotion also used in certain oral pharmaceuticals for sweetening solvent and preservative properties also, in the, oh, I don't want to read that part word. Sure, you do. It's for suppositories. Oh, um, <laughs> and that's in another language I can't read. And it's a hundred percent. It's a hundred percent vegan. It's like a. It's a vegetable. Um, it's made. <clears throat> I don't know what it's made out of. And you can go to www.simplehomeremedies.com to find out more helpful hints about glycerin. Oh. Yeah, it's very smooth. Like if you put it on your hands and mm -hmm. you just want to smooth it up, it's very, see how it's, it's a oil, it's very oily though. Oily? Yeah, like I can't touch anything right now, but it's, yeah. I mean, you know how like in the winter you like to put, I don't know. I put like Vaseline all over my feet. So do I. Put mm -hmm. socks on and you get it yep. really soft. Well, I'm going to start using this on my like heels and stuff. Because you know how they get, um, what you would call it, dry in the winter and everything. Oh, yeah. And then it just comes right off. Now my hand is not greasy at all. Wow. You know what else it's good for, ladies? Mascara. When your mascara starts getting dry, just add two or three drops of glycerin. Bring it right back to life. Really? That is a great idea. Yep. Because I have my finger mascara right now, and it is going dry, and it makes me sad. I don't want it to go dry. Oh, have a good night, Susan. Good night, she's, Susan. Hey, Susan. Leaving us, she's leaving us with a great uh, little post there. <laughs> she says it makes candy shiny. It works as a laxative because it grabs all your water in one place. Got to go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what it says. It's for suppositories. On the back. <laughs> that's the word. Lily says, I was so confused for a time by chipboard girls were talking about. It's Aussie chipboard is a reconstituted shredder, shredded timber, and it's heavy, thick stuff used um, for cardboard than laminated. For cupboards that are lam then laminated. You're talking. Oh, yeah. See. You got to start you're, reading the chat. You're for not me. talking I, about chipboard. You're talking about uh, particle board. Uh, that particle and, board is actually yeah. reconstituted 
shredded timber mixed with a glue. And yes, that's what they use for cupboards and laminated. MFD, right? Huh? MFD? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't think Susan's leaving us, yeah, by the I way. Yeah, I was going to tell you, Maggie, not leave <laughs> her. I like, you. I don't think you're leaving again, Maggie. You're saying goodbye to people, and they're staying. I know. That's the second <laughs> time, right, I did that? Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry, not Susan. Leaving. Oh, my gosh. See, that's why I said you got to. She was saying with laxatives, and you know, you take one, got to yeah. go. Right. Got to go. Okay, I'm not reading the chat anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Maggie is no longer allowed to read chat in no. over. MDF, yes, Kim, correct. MDF board. MDF yep. board, manufactured. And if you get it wet, it swells like there's no tomorrow and falls apart. MDF is medium density fiber board. I think, isn't it? Yeah, it's medium, also, yeah. you know. Like medium density board. fiber fiber board. Uh, man, particle board is the heaviest stuff you'll ever buy when you're buying a cabinet or something made out of it. It's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. But once you put it together, don't try and take it apart and put it together again because yeah, it's not like, like wood. It doesn't work like that. It like basically strips all the holes. Like this right here. Is like the back of a um, a notebook paper, a notebook. and I could squirt it with the glycerin, and you could just start watching it go and break apart and make this turn this into leather or nice. a leather like looking substance. Yep, faux leather, leather, a faux leather. That's it. Like a pleather. Yep, you're right, Susan. I should know enough about wood. I was married to a carpenter for quite a long time. Although if you think about it now, it wasn't very long, very long, and because it was so long ago, you know, mm -hmm. I was like, really, it wasn't that long. You know what I want to know is, after you get a divorce, yeah, and you've been, yes, do you, you put single or sep or divorced? Is when that what you're going to ask? Start putting single again because I've been single more than I've been married. So why? Right, are I just. I just put single. If it's I something that when it's something that asks with my kids, I'll put divorced. You know, but uh, yeah, you're basically single now. You know. Yeah, no, I've I'm been putting single. I even put single on Jaden stuff too, because I'm like, really, for real, it's you know, it was a blip yeah. on my radar, pretty much. Right. Basically. All right, Michelle, you make enough books. So is eight or nine more standard? Eight inches or nine inches? For, for books? Yeah. Um, I would go nine because mine are eight and three quarters. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, you just got to grind this up because it's too wide. Well, I, I'm getting more than I thought I would get done today, tonight. Okay, that's just a tuck spot. So Lorna, working on any more journals? <laughs> she did those 12 Christmas right, journals. That's why I said it. Yeah. <laughs> She's working on Valentine's already. Right? You must be in the UK, Lily. We have chipboard here as well in Canada. MDF and plywood. And 
cardboard, they are all in the hardware store. But this chipboard is different. Yes, chipboard is different. It's like layers of cardboard. Yeah, chipboard is, um, I have some right up here. As a matter of fact, I have all the good sizes of chipboard. Chipboard, bookboard, whatever you want to call it. it yeah, exactly. Sizes, densities, colors. Like this is a thinner, and this could even this is this is could be broken down, and made into a min, mini faux journal. Um, this is a little bit thicker. This is probably like a medium weight. And then I have some really, really thick stuff that is a heavyweight um, that I use for books sometimes. And these are great for spines. Comes in all different kinds of colors, whatever you want. She needs more. She needs more. And these are those stretchy things. Yeah. I'm going to put one in those in my hair one night. See if you guys notice. What <laughs> <laughs> is on your head? Woman. Okay, I'm looking up. Speaking of crafts, lining four photo created even. They were a little confusing now. I can hold camera. Yeah, they're all talking about wood. Nice Thank you, cardboard. I just finished lining four photo boxes with my endless supply corrugated. Even mm, they were a little flimsy. Now they can hold hammers. That's awesome, Susan. <laughs> Lorna says I was so confused in the in the beginning when everyone kept saying they were using chipboard and I could not find it in any craft store. <laughs> So, Lorna, do you have chipboard and bookboard? They might just call it something else, right? No, I'm, do you I just repurpose and alter look books? It is actually called because I got mine at Walmart.com, and then they just sent it to my store, and I went and picked it up. But I have black. Oh, of course it's up. Oh, I have black, and it says chipboard black, medium weight. 25 sheets so yeah they do sell it in the store um but it's over by the paint like the copy paper and stuff i believe is where they keep it but i i think i couldn't find it either lorna so i actually went online and ordered it and they sent it right to my store but i have black and beige yeah don't forget lorna's in canada do they have my right. in canada and they oh, call it a mat board there Lots of different things that you can use for book board. I use heavy chip chip book, or I use heavy chip book. Um, chip what board. is a chip? What is a chip book? Listen, shut it. <laughs> <laughs> I use chip book. Okay. <laughs> this is my book made out of chip book. Oh, <laughs> um, book board can be. Uh, <coughs> At either the real heavy um uh cards card <laughs> no i don't even know what it's called <laughs> clipboard card stock <laughs> no bookboard can be heavy heavy chipboard or i use um a masonite yeah and lily says they don't have walmart over in australia it has a million dollars. Yeah, right mat board there. would be the same thing. You're right, Lorna. Mat board. 
Lorna says, it's a new thing, Maggie. Stay in the loop. <laughs> <laughs> I try, Lorna. I try. Matt Ward. Yes, you can say that, Susan. Take it back. <laughs> That's funny. Can I say that, Maggie? Of course you can. Of course you can. Right, that, piece is, that piece is done. There's nine inches right there. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, and you can whip that puppy right out, too. I'll try and hold it yeah. on a piece of paper. So yeah, wait a minute. Let me put it on you so Remember, they can see it really like close up. In picture. Oh, that has pink beads. Yeah, that this has pink beads. Oh, shut the front door. <laughs> I love that. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, yes. I like it with the beads. Were you able to use that vintage um, stuff? I, I only have two hands a, a little bit at a time there, Michelle. <laughs> but I will be using it. Yes, I will be able to use is it, it. Yeah, is it sure. like stuff that you can cool? Yes. Yep. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure I watch Handmade by Diana yep. too. That's awesome. Oh, I love that. Especially Thank you. Yeah, that. it's beautiful. Susan said, Laurel, you learn something and take it to a whole nother level. I always, it's just, I have to, I have to. She does. Yeah. She's, a, she's like the queen of detail in there. Like, that's amazing. And I will tell you, not one stitch is out of place in nope. that thing. No, right. nope. she will go back and take that thing apart until, and it could be halfway through, and she'll be like, "Oh," and she will pick it out literally, oh, yeah. it yep. strand by strand, and make sure it is perfect. Thank you, Louise. Thank you, Kim. All right, now I need a regular needle so I can sew in my threads. And then what will, shall I work on next? <laughs> All right, let's find my needle. Right here. Crazy lamp lady. Lampshade level. Crazy lamp lady. Yeah. All right. Yep. Crazy lamp lady. Yeah. She's funny. Her name is Jocelyn. She also has another channel where she, which is her, she, Crazy Lamp Lady is her second channel, actually. Her first channel is, um, uh, anyways, it's, she takes metal detectors out and finds metals and old coins and arrowheads and things like that. Oh, really? Uh huh. That's her her first main channel. Crazy lamp lady is like a hobby. But she's so fun, and her best friends do also have the channel now, and I watch her too. It's called Sue Me. <laughs> <laughs> That's All funny. Words. S U E M E. Yep, crazy lamp lady. I'm just in here watching chat now. That's awesome. Thanks for all the thumbs up. Yes. Thank you. Maggie, say 20, turn that game on, woman. Oh, okay. I'll, I don't won't have any sound though. I'm just gonna turn it on. But if you hear me yell, <laughs> I'm just going to say, watch your language there. <laughs> She's not monetized. It's okay. Say what you will, Meg. It's football. 
and it's her team. You know what I need to do? This. This is insanity right here, okay? Oh my gosh, you wouldn't believe how windy it is out. S send it to me. I'll undo it for you, Michelle. I mean, insanity, Lorel. Like, I, I have to put a couple things. of things. Wow, that is insanity. That is right? Yeah. We're all hanging up. And I have like the coolest charms and stuff to hang on off of like journals. I just can't get to them. So, what I usually end up doing is just using my jewelry snippers. And I just pick apart the piece that I want. I just saw this really cool piece that would look really cute. Isn't that cool? It's a cool stone. There. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks really pretty. And see, so you could go around a frame with it. A round frame if you wanted. See, doesn't that look pretty like that, Michelle? If it was around an image. Oh, that it does. Yeah, that would look really pretty around an image. Um, you could just do straight and we could turn it ourselves. Probably should have put a boot on that end one. See? See what I did now? See? Oh my God, that'll make me crazy. Don't think about it, Laurel. Don't think about it. <laughs> All right. All right. What shall I do now? What are you going to make now? I don't know. That piece is done. Yeah. Oh, I'm, I made a beautiful collar, Susan. I just haven't put the uh, I haven't put the um sorry ribbon on it yet in the clasps, but I oh did yeah, it. she did. Oh, uh, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I I love watercolor watercolor painting, Lily. That was my first love. I started drawing and stuff when I was eight. I've done everything but oil painting. I've done charcoal and pencil and pastels and colored pencil, and but I've never done oil painting. Does paint by numbers count? <laughs> oh, painting by numbers, oil painting is very hard, believe it or not. It and never that, looks right, though. Right, because you got to learn how to blend those colors. That's what I mean. Oil right. painting is hard. My dad does that. He's a very good artist. I get it from him, actually. Get it from my father. He can look at a picture and, and well, so can I, and draw it. Yeah, my son can do that. He's good at, um, he did a, a whole um, sketchbook of celebrities, portraits. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. That's the one thing I can't draw is people. No, I he can draw can people. Not draw people. No, I can't yeah. either. Oh, and see, I love drawing people. <laughs> not unless stick people are count. I love people and people and animals. All right. I think and then we're... when the twins were little, I did a mural in their bedroom, and it had a dragon coming out of a. But I like the dragon's tail coming out of a cave, and it said, Don't feed the dragon. And then there was tr a big tree. Oh, cool. Yeah, their room was really cool. And then, like, well, the Susan, oh, sorry. You're fine. Susan wants to know if you installed the purple decorated light switch cover. Yes, I did. Right after I finished it, Susan. She said that was the coolest. Yes, I did. It's hanging on my wall. Trust me. I totally remember that night and that live. Yeah. Yeah. When we were all like, you're doing what? And and we were, remember, we were, we were, afraid, we were afraid that if we flipped it on and off that it would knock off all the stuff. It, it didn't. <laughs> that was really pretty. You did it with that um, pretty napkin. You decoupaged it and yeah. sent it flowers and stuff all around it yep, and dangles hanging from it yep i'm staring at it right now it's hanging on my wall 
that was pretty flipping cool. Yep, all my accessories have to match. So, all right, let's make a little. Um, I need a smaller needle than that. No, now I need to go smaller again. She said, but when you come on, I always snoop in the background looking for it. It's in front of her, Susan. Yeah, you can't see it. It's in facing right as yeah. you walk the door. Right. Yeah, when you see behind me, you're seeing my back wall. Mm hmm She sits right by the door. At least you don't have to go under it anymore. Right. Under the under the desk anymore? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh I'll my have gosh. To, uh, I'll have to scope around my room, even though it's a disaster, and let you guys see that I do actually my stuff I make is around my room. Oh, it's everywhere. Yes, yeah, it is. It is everywhere. <laughs> Literally everywhere. Yeah. I've always wanted to do like a show all type thing of my room, but it's it, no. <laughs> no. Just no. Just no. Just no. Just let you know my, my clothes are hanging in Jaden's closet now. That's that's how that is. Oh, I've taken over half of Cam's closet. There's oh, bookshelves. There's bookshelves in my because you guys, I, I, because of the auctions too. I have uh, one, two, three, four new bookshelves in my room for all the books that we auction. I can actually show you the one I'm working on right now that is a nightmare. So any of you that want, want to order from me or should ever want to order from me, I'm just going to let you know now, if you order black, there will be an upcharge. Because <laughs> it is a frigging nightmare to work with. Let's see if I can get it out of here. What yeah, she didn't mean? like using the black. Oh, my gosh. Hmm. Not at all. Is that because it's harder to see? You, or? Can't, you cannot see the stitches at all. At all. I'm going to throw you. I mean, it's really pretty, but man, when you're working with it, it's, and this one's really tiny thread. So you're going to see, this is what I mean by different threads. So here's the one I just did. And here's this one. You can see how much smaller it is, how much smaller the stitches are. But um, it's so dainty. <laughs> but I mean, you just can't. <laughs> wow. So hard to see the stitches on the black. But this wow. is uh, and I did so many things in black. The the butterflies, all the flowers, the little doilies. <laughs> Just like, oh my gosh, let me get done with this black. Because it is crazy to work with. But I might as well work on this one while I'm sitting here. Huh. So if I make a mistake, it's really hard to see it is the problem. But I went on looking to see if they had smaller needles yet. And actually this, uh, this one I'm using is the smallest. Well, I mean, you can barely even see it. Hey, I wanted it smaller. Can't get this one close enough for some reason. I can't believe you use those things. I, I have one of those in my hand, and I was like, uh-uh. There's no way she can do with this stuff. Right. I mean, because I remember the big, remember the Latra rugs? Yes. Yep. That, that thing was huge. And these are like the little, like, teeny tiniest. This little hook that you get that string on or what the thread, whatever it is you use. Oh, my 
goodness. I was like, you got to be kidding me. Are you? It's crazy. Yeah. I don't even see how she sees the hook. I don't. I'm it's doing so it with funny. my eyes closed, remember? Yeah, she does it with her <laughs> eyes closed. Oh, I forgot. Look at that. I forgot. I'm saying it's very it's very relaxing to watch you do this. <laughs> it's very relaxing to do it, believe it or not. Really, Susan? Wow. It's fantastic. What'd she say? She said one lady in our group had a stroke and her left hand is always curled inward. She actually fixed up some way to crochet and she fussy cuts too. Nice. I don't cussy cut. Laurel, Laurel extreme cussy cuts. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she does. I have nothing to do with that. Absolutely. I spent three hours cutting one fern. <laughs> Oh, and I find that very relaxing too. What is the problem here? Why, 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 why? What are you doing? Oh, no, no. Susan, <laughs> she said, when something is just too aggravating for me, I just quit and call it something else. My quilt became a pillow. <laughs> yeah. All right. So this black has a teeny tiny, you guys won't see it, but there's a teeny tiny knot right there that I have to get out. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is what I usually do with the fishing line. I sit here with a little piece of fishing line trying to get a knot out. All right, we're going to put that one to the side for now because I don't want to fight with that right now. But that's my own fault for letting it get knotted up. Are those like six inch doll needles that you're using? No, uh, well, they're like doll needles, but like this one, where's the one I just had? This one right here is a size, um, this is the small size, but you can see how thin it is. Then mm -hmm. they get a little bit thicker. And yeah, you know, so they get a little bit thicker. There's four of them. There are other sizes, there are bigger ones, but I was looking for a smaller one than this, but I guess you can't <laughs> really make a tatting because like, see, this bends because it's so thin. So I don't oh think, you can, I don't think you can make it much thinner than this. I think this is pretty, pretty much a, as thin as it's going to get. I use the um, four inch doll needles for like making my flowers and sewing yeah. in signatures and things like that. It's easier on your hands. Yes, it for is. Sure. For sure. Yeah, I have doll needles too, but I suppose I could use them, but I don't know what size they are. Um, and this kind of goes by thread, but I kind of just do what works for me. Oh, thank you, Lily. Lily says that's gorgeous, Mags. Yeah, Mags always creates gorgeous things. Mm. Always. So now I need to start loading beads on here because I want this one to have beads too. Now these are my really good beads. These are my Delica beads and these are a 15-0. And if any of you guys know about beading, I mean, I'll show you the difference in one of these. So here's this one. If you guys can see them and then you Wait, might not, let me put it on you. You might not even be able to see it. It's so tiny. Oh, but that's. That's a 15 OC bead. Wow. That's a 12 OC bead. So they're like super teeny tiny. I want to have six pairs of glasses on my face to even think about doing that. But I love working with these teeny tiny seed beads like that. Wow. Or Delica beads. I don't think they're even actually called seed beads. They're just Delica beads because they're oh. so small. Gosh. And they're like so exact and precise. Every bead is exactly the same. That's what I like. Same shape, same everything. They're all the same. 
you know, one's not bigger or fatter or longer. They're all exactly, they're all exactly the same size. No, couldn't be me. I'd have to have six pairs of readers on to see this. And see, this is what's nice about this mat. You just put your needle to the bead and push down and roll and it goes right on your needle. And they don't jump all over the place. No, it's wow. like a, they're like a foam, right? No, it's not foam. But they do sell it at Hobby Lobby. Mine are 20 something years old, but they do sell them. I have seen them recently. I can't explain the material. It's like got this fur on one side and furry, not a fur even, and then something up the middle. But yeah, they're great for beads. What did you just put those things right on there? They just roll right on there, which is... <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, no, I couldn't do it. Well, this is, what did you do, Laurel? Kick Maggie and Michelle off? <laughs> oh, yeah, you can. Because I, I, I put it on you. Yeah, you can take it off me. They don't need to see me. Oh, this is fascinating. I'm watching. Beads on, you know, on well, thread. I'm just, Look how quick you do that. I'm telling you, this mat makes it possible. You, I just barely push down on the mat, and my the beads go on there. I'm going to... Uh, and then you just pull up a bead whenever you want it in your cat. Correct. Correct. Oh, no. That's... I didn't want to do that. Uh oh Maggie's touching buttons. Yeah, I'm going to play with this for a second. And what's that green thing in your hand? This was a uh, a needle threader. It helped get my needle, the th thread back on my needle because it's got such a small hole at the end. And then I just fill up as many as I think I'm going to use. I always put extras because heavens forbid I run out in the middle of a project. Susan, I think I just need one of those period in my life right there. One of those just magnifying glasses that just on an arm that comes right over my desk and I just peer into it and like that's what I need right there. You know they do have them Michelle because I have one it's and it's got a light in it too and you mm. can actually tip it right over you and put your work right underneath it. She says it helps with her jewelry making. That's perfect. Oh, yeah. really? These needles are um, tatting needles. You're using a tatting needle to pick up the beads? Well, yeah, because I'm going to be tatting. And she just pulls a bead up, Meg, whenever she needs it. That's just crazy. Yeah. I just like that they don't jump all over this mat and stuff. They just stay right there. <laughs> That's probably plenty. Lorna, I did not know that. I just learned something new about you. I did not know that. What? You can read her comment. Oh, Lorna's? Yeah. I did not know that. Oh, I did. Wow. <laughs> Lorna says, what I need is an assistant, Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> do all the hard work like videos and sewing and signatures. <laughs> send them down. Send them down. See, and that, uh, that's the parts I like. Is that, that those parts. I, we, Maggie and I talked about this today. What's up there, Fowler? Um, I will hey, Paula. I make covers all day. <laughs> all day yep. long and to sit here and think man now i gotta sew in pages <laughs> and it only takes me it doesn't take it doesn't take that long to do it but you know getting them ready and prepping them and stuff like that right and he's like man i'd make covers all the time i did not know that lorna why did i not know that 
bless your heart you work your little booty off on those videos let me tell you yeah it just it makes and it I'm more amazing sure. the work she does too mm -hmm. amazing totally impressed yeah i said i'd be happy if people just sent me their journals i do the covers for them <laughs> yeah. i love doing the covers that's what i was hi gonna paula do. Sorry, hi. I missed it when you guys said hi so i was saying hi i've gotten really good at determining how much thread i need to, so i quit wasting it you got a little scooper and <laughs> i told you i could own a bead store no, oh, I've, I've seen the beads. Oh, yes, she could. Remind me to ask you a question about that thread you're using there after the show there, Laura. Okay. Yeah, I love these with the tiny little beads, the delica beads. That's just so dainty. It's just amazing. Need to bring a bunch of them forward, though. You outlining that tag, Meg? I am. Mainly because I put, you know, the um, the book page behind it, and then mm -hmm. I added the little tag that says splendid nature and i had to outline it so it didn't get lost so then i just outlined so why don't you make yourself big again so we can see like to see your uh, tags bigger please okay let's click michelle off because michelle's just enjoying the chat right now go to laurel and maggie okay so this is the one i just finished here that is so pretty mag I love those. Now, images. what is that image from? Look at the image you have and look what I'm working with. Oh, isn't that funny? Yep. Yep. That She's working on her Taddy Daydream collection. Yep. They, um, this is going to be a flip out. So this will get adhered to a page and then this just flips out and there's two pockets in here. I just stuck these tags in here for now. But yeah, yeah. this is one of the images from um, from Tracy's. And this is one too, this picture here. It looks like a yeah, picture yeah. in a frame I mean, from no. a different one. Yep. And then this one will go the opposite way. It'll open this way. And this I used as a tuck, tuck spot. And this I just you know added this here. This is another image. Patty Daydream. Well. Everybody yeah. loves it, Max. Oh, thank I you. I love that image on the back of that one. And then these are the other tags I made. Went to, I did this tonight. This one here. You're rocking those tags, Max. Yeah. Aren't I? And then this one, these two I were the ones I made on Michelle's Live this morning. Whoops, wasn't in frame. So yeah, these are fun. I don't know why. I, it, it seems like I have a harder time. The smaller the area to, you know, to create, I have a harder time. It takes me a while. Uh huh. Did you and use I, the frame yet on that Patty Daydreams? I did. Uh. Oh, where's that? What did you do? I'll show you what I did with it. Hang on. Thank you, ladies. Fine. Let me um, put us back so I can see when you get in here. No, I don't like that one. This one. Oh, thanks, Kim. You like the first one? The first tag, this one here. This wasn't from one of hers. I don't think this was from one of hers, though. I think this was from... No, this was from a um, a piece of uh, one of the old paper lines I have. Well, all my paper lines are old. It's been so long since I used paper. Wow. 
I go figure out which project it is. Yeah, I want to see. I want to see. Um, I think I might. I like making these because it almost seems like it's a like it's a little book, so it's easier to it's to know what to do. Yeah, she's making these for when she does her next journal, Susan. Yeah, I like to make things ahead of time. That way, there I have them. I haven't done um, I like something on your left. I don't know what. How you doing, Paula? Haven't talked to you in a while. That was on your left. And she said, no, the other one. I don't know what she's talking about. Oh, I don't know. This one? Let's guess. Is it this one? Was it a tag? Um, it's that one that has the picture frame and the flowers around it from Patty Daydream. I did something with it. And hold on, I'm looking through a gazillion finished and unfinished projects. Hold on, one sec. Oh, I think it's in here. Okay, Lily. She's gonna take her pups outside for a play. She'll be back soon. Yeah, that that tag. This one. This right here. Um it's from her Taddy Daydreams. And do you know what I'm talking about now? This frame right yes. here. Yes. Yep. I printed the frame twice, actually. Um because this is this is it right here. Hold on. I did it twice and then um she had the the ladies, right? The yeah. pretty tatty ladies. Yeah. I printed um I printed her out on transparency paper. She was right here and put her in that frame mm -hmm. for the tatty and now it's all with her tatty kit. Nice. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Just something, a little mini one. I don't usually dabble too much in minis, but um, I got inspired by uh, my porch prince. I love her. Who? Who again? My porch prince. My porch prince. I just uh, bought a bunch of digitals from her. All right. I got to write that down because that name doesn't sound familiar. And um, I just bought her whole grandma's attic collection and it was, it's amazing. Um, really talented girl. And I followed a tutorial that she was doing on creating that little mini journal there. Cause I've never worked with that before, uh -huh. nor had she. And I learned a lot from her because she, she had never done a journal like that before. So we learned with her to do the mistakes and to fix the mistakes and it's really that's why again you everybody should not be afraid to show their work because right even you know people you think you know know a lot and stuff like that so we still you know gotta we love help and we love seeing new ideas for yeah. sure Oh, Kim said, what's her name, please? My Porch Prince. My Porch Print? Prince, with, with an S at the end. Yep. And um, her digital kit that she uses in this series is called uh, Grandma's Attic. Or, yeah, My Grandma's Attic or something like that. Yeah. And that sounds uh, familiar. I printed all of them out. I actually got a couple of her kits, and it's they really, really cute, adorable young girl. Very talented. Very, very talented. Do you ever watch um Izzy B, Michelle? Um, Izzy B, I watched her, and then she went on hiatus for a little bit. I just have to go and resubscribe to her. I like her. I like yeah, her. Yeah, I like her too. She's a young girl too. Yeah. Yeah, she's good. Oh, thank you, Paula. 
what don't you share anymore? I don't, Paula says, I don't share mine anymore. What don't you share? Her projects. I don't know why. I don't either. You need to share them, Paula. Oh, I like Al John too, Susan. You need to share. I finished I, one of my journals that's going up for uh, up with the four is you my Lorna Taylor one, the sewing ephemera, vintage sewing ephemera. I've never done uh, any kind of sewing theme book. Really? And it was also my very first hardback carpet bagger book. And it's it turned out beautiful, Lorna. I just want to tell you that. I did you proud. I did you proud. I just have to find time. Um, well, I still have one more to finish because I want to roll out like four. And um, then I need to find time to film. <laughs> to film them. Because I have one that I haven't even started. I just have the cover for right now. And it's a tome. And Maggie saw me picking the stuff out for that. And um, that that one will be made um, with the uh, my porch prints. But I can show you the tome the cover of it. Nice. Lorna said, oh, those beautiful. Americans don't speak English. <laughs> 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 she says Lorna Taylor won what? She said, I'm just happy your videos are nice and clear now, Michelle, and that you're doing live crafts again. Oh, thanks, Lorna. <coughs> we'll definitely be doing it a lot more. Now uh we know Laurel's break time <coughs> at work. Um so she can pop in too. Um, they'll, the crafting videos will almost always be probably during the day. For sure. I'll be right back. And Paula wants to know, Laurel, what was the one you said? Uh, Izzy B Creations. Izzy, yeah. Izzy B, yeah. I-Z-Z-Y-B-E-E. -E. Izzy B's. It might be an S at the end. Izzy B's Creations. <coughs> I've got this cough coming. Oh, my God. If I am getting sick again, I'm going to have a heart attack. That's not good. Susan's like, I think we probably sound slow and lazy to the rest of the world. <laughs> Lorna says, you know us Canadians have the best English. Is she supposed to follow that with A? The best English, eh? Or is that just in the movies? Or do you truly say that? I think I'm thinking of Wayne's World. <laughs> or something. Where they always said, eh? Party on, eh? Party on, Garth. She said, we don't say, eh? <laughs> I think Canadians say some strange stuff, eh? <laughs> so Susan, Susan and Laura, you guys must be in two parts of Canada. Yeah, this, uh, yeah, some parts don't say that. My um, my relatives, up, <laughs> my relatives in New Brunswick say it all. I used to go visit, and when I'd come home, it would take me a good week or two to stop saying eh. <laughs> Susan, but yeah, there are parts that they don't say it. No. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> and now Louise says, I agree, Lorna. We don't say A. A? That's too big. 
That's funny, Louise. If you guys aren't subscribed to each other, please do. Yes. Please, please do. I am from Newfoundland. They say a lot of weird words, but not A. <laughs> I'm in, oh, you live in, you live in Alabama, Susan? Oh, my goodness. Did you think she lived somewhere else? Or you... I thought she lived in Canada. Oh, maybe she did it one time. I'm and now she's in. <coughs> Newfoundland has its own form of English. English. Thank you, uh, Paula. Yes, Izzy B's Creations. Newfoundland has its own form. It says, and I don't say about. Oh. <laughs> 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 I love this. Oh, my gosh. About. Oh. About. I so don't say about. Yeah. About. Instead of about. She lives in, in Alabama now. This is fascinating. I'm loving this. Sorry, no one's learning anything from me tonight. My bad. <laughs> nope, I've been to Canada. but Oh, okay. You've been to Canada, but you're from the U.S. Okay. Gotcha, Susan. So you are from Alabama. Okay. Or live in northern Alabama now. Gotcha. Everybody says we we have accents. Maggie says definitely. definitely. I don't have an accent. Are you kidding me right now? Right, right. <laughs> what you accent? Are on to something earlier, and I was gonna say something, and I can't, I can't remember what it was. <laughs> really? Yeah, you add an R on the thing. Yeah, drawer. When she says drawer, you hear it come out in certain words when she says them. It's, yeah, she said something that she was going to go do or something, and then an R came on the end of it, and I was just giggled to myself. Every time yeah. she does that, I go, oh, there's that accent. <laughs> there's my porch prince. That she's, she's really cute. Watch, watch the. Uh, I think she did six part um, journal made out of. That's why I have all this extra file folder. <laughs> Susan said, Maggie, come on. <laughs> well, that's, that's like when people say, wow, you have a Chicago accent. And I'm like, what are you talking about? I talk like do. everybody else. <laughs> but you do. No, you talk like Chicago. And everybody always says, you sound like you're from the north. Where, 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 where do I live? Midwest. Midwest accent. I'm like, no, I don't think I do. Louise says, my favorite American word is crayon. 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 Uh, crayon. Do you not say, do you not call them crayons? All three of us have different accents. Interesting. Oh, gosh. And then get Patty on here. Right. <laughs> Draw of hers. She would be closer to Laurel, though, because she's from, like, right. the Chicago area. Right. Right. That's me touching my camera. Sorry, guys. Louise, how do you say crayon? Right. I'm curious now. She said, that's not fun. You all said it correctly. What we're supposed to say. Uh, oh, crayon? How, uh, crayon? There's, crayon? No, there's no other way to say it, is there? Right. Crayon. 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 
Oh, southern states say it funny. Oh, the, the southern, yeah, the slow, the like slangy type of. You gotta put that twang in there, get the crayon. Yeah, that's what she's talking about. I'm literally just sitting here watching chat. Sorry. <laughs> I bet you'll have me on again as a special guest. Man. Fun to sit in of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Of course. She says, Maggie says it funny. Maggie, say crayon. Crayon? <laughs> You're thinking about it. Wait, we'll ask her in 10 minutes. No, just no, just crayon. Say drawer, Mag. Drawer. No, there's Trying to think of the word where the accent I, I always know she comes has out. An or on something I can't remember. I can't remember what it is. Next time she says that, I'll be like, that's the word. But you all say, say fur instead of no, I say four. I don't say yeah. fur. The southerners yeah, say four. four. I say four. I say four. Yeah, that's down. Right. That, that's either up in Maine or, yeah, I bet up in Maine they say fur. What you going to do for her? No, it's four. Definitely four. Paul said, never heard that one, Lorna. <laughs> Yeah, we don't usually, we don't pronounce our R's at the end of words, usually, you know, like instead of chowder, we say chowder. What? Clam chowder. Fur? Huh? She says, oh, not Missy Michelle, you always say fur. What? Do I really? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I don't watch my videos. Oh my gosh. So, no. That's right, Kim. I say draw. There's I no say R draw. The I, call it, I call it a jaw. My mom corrected me my whole life. It's not a jaw, it's a drawer. I'm like, that is very hard to say. It's easier to say, open it the jaw. It is hard to say. Open the jaw. There, open the jaw. I say open the drawer. Drawer. But when you talk to Tracy, if you tell her something about a drawer, she's like, those are their pants. Right. Right. Their yep. It's their drawers. It's their clothing, like their pants. Yeah. <clears throat> and pants is their, ba their bad word. That's right. They're fixing to go. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> We're fixing to go to the Walmart. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, Lorna makes fun of all of us in her head. She was a speech therapist. <laughs> yeah. She never again. That's oh my happened. goodness. <laughs> oh my I God. Will never, ever, I will enunciate like See, crazy. And that, that's what <laughs> I do. I enunciate and drag out my words. Like I have to say, like, I will totally all the letters when I talk. Oh, no. my words just for Lorna Taylor. Yeah, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much too much thinking in my head to do that. It is. Walmarts, Kmarts. <laughs> she said, you all are awesome. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Too funny. Kim said, what the heck, Laurel? <laughs> Drawer? <laughs> Drawer. Oh, we should totally have Lorna on and have her speak Newfoundlander. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Newfoundlander? Yeah. Let me Newfoundlander. Let me take that for you. Newfoundlander. 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 Wally's World. That's right. Wally's World. And Target. 
Oh my gosh. Oh, Lorna, just call me and read me the phone book, please. <laughs> this sounds wonderful. Right. Just like I want Louise just to call me and just read me a French book every night to sleep. <laughs> well, that's that's like I think I watch Outlander just to listen to him talk and that Scottish. Oh my. When he calls her Sassenac, I'm just like, oh, I just melt like butter. Oh, I love his accent. It's Newfoundlander. Newfoundlander. That's what it is. I've never spoke in a... Oh, Lorna said she also went to convent school. We were never allowed to speak anything other than the Queen's proper English. I'm telling you, that's why I want her to read me the phone book. Kim Stevenson is really trying to get your attention there, Laurel. Oh, yes, Kim. Yeah, open your eyes. <laughs> yes, I do speak my I I very much enunciate. I think that's when people say I have a Chicago accent, it's because I enunciate like <laughs> the whole word when I talk. And I can do it really fast too. <laughs> She's really compelled to tell you too when you do not talk right. I want I want Lorna to tell me what I'm saying wrong so I can correct myself. <laughs> I know me too. She's Hi Mary. You guys all in my head. <laughs> <coughs> Hello, Mary. Hi, Mary. How are you? And you spelled my name right. Yes. Oh yeah, Susan's Susan's got a good point. And here, here they say be Pacific instead of specific i i say specific but i yeah. i have heard people say pacific instead of specific you know the word that i think jane has the worst i don't think he can say it or he can't say it or i can't say it is statistics so the statistic statistics six you know what i'm talking about statistics there was yes. a word I used to say that I say correct now, and I want to say it's probably um because this guy I dated corrected me. Ever, supposedly, I always used to say supposedly, and he'd go, "It's supposedly." I'm like, I don't care, but now it's ingrained in my brain. <laughs> so now I say supposedly. Supposedly. Yeah, it's I've heard people say, got me say, say that too. Oh, got me. Oh my gosh. That's it. I'm just shutting up. <laughs> you guys tell me saying every time that I say I want to say library, I'm like library. Oh, they the kids on the bus, I'm like library night. I'm like it's library, brr, you know, brary. <laughs> yeah, uh, library. I'm like no, you go to the library. <laughs> Specific, specific yeah. say it's statistic statistic what statistic. mary said sad statistic <laughs> statistic kim says i can't say regularly regular she probably oh, says regularly regular regularly i can't either kim. <laughs> oh my god it's regularly <laughs> Regularly. Can you say Worcestershire sauce? Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. Okay. Can you say anti disestablishment and terrorism? And no, let me tell you, Lorna, the library. I know it's library. But we were talking about some subject one time and <laughs> we were making fun of. Oh, Is Cam going to the library to watch Netflix. Yeah. <laughs> so we had said it so much that night. I now when I say it, I'm like, so anyway, to the library. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I know yep, this. You say library all the time now. Ambulance? Ambulance. Yeah, we just say ambulance. 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 It's not abu it's not ambulance, it's ambulance. What's this here sauce? Really, what is it? 
Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. <laughs> Worcestershire sauce. You gotta say it fast. Worcestershire. I like the way that she says it. Worcestershire sauce. <laughs> it's uh, Worcestershire sauce. Yeah, it's like it's really a, salty. It's a steak sauce. Yeah. yeah, it's very salty, almost like a soy, but not like a soy. Right. Look at we're all getting proper English lessons tonight on. So, Oda, what are some of the hardest words to enunciate or say? Yeah, like I want to know like what words people say wrong. Uh huh. Well, I think according to Lorna, they all right, they say all them wrong. all wrong. <laughs> They're all wrong. Everything is all wrong. <laughs> Everybody talks all wrong. So that one, one can say right. All words sound weird once you say them a few times. Yes, they do. You know, like sometimes when you haven't said a word in a long time, like a really small word, like when, when, when. It just, it just sounds weird. See, she said all of them. All of them. Really? Do you find it that when right, you Paula, we'll be here when you speak that you have to really really think about what you're saying because you're a speech therapist just like a dentist has to have a really really white smile because he's the dentist supercalifragilisticexpialidocious she just yeah. spelled that wow no it's just different ways of saying things. You are all doing awesome. Thank you. Well, we've made, I've made it 47 years with this mouth so far. <laughs> what was that word I just said ago? I said, can you guys say it and spell it? My mom used to do it for us all the time. Now that's engraved in my brain. Now I can't remember what the word is I just said. Mary just spelled oh. super fragilistic. Yeah, it's, it's anti disestablishment and tyrannism. Uh, and N-T-I-D-I-S-T-A-S-T-A-B-L-I-S-H-M-E-N-T-A-R-T-I-A-N, -E -A 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 something like that. Yeah, wasn't that in typing class or something? I don't know. My mom used to do it all the time. Hi, Deborah. <laughs> Hi, Deborah. <laughs> She's like, I'm hillbilly, can say anything right. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. All right, hold on. I'll be right back in just a moment. Okay. Yeah, Susan's like, well, Deborah, I'm a fixin' to get a coffee refill. <laughs> <laughs> Here we just said I need a cup of Joe. Need a cup of Joe. Oh my gosh, that's funny. I don't know. Since I'm the grammar police, Lorna, I pretty much think I say all things right. <laughs> yeah, she is the grammar. Grammar. How do you? <laughs> grammar? Grammar. Grammar. Right. Grammar. grammar police. Any of us say a word wrong, she's right there to correct us. This one gets no bead. No bead there. Oh, this is the one I gotta connect. Stop it, Laurel. Okay, Mary says, "What are you making, Laurel?" I'm, I'm, I'm still tatting, Mary, like I'm always doing <laughs> lately. It's, it's my go-to thing is to tat. So I'm making another little doily with some very teeny, <coughs> tiny beads. I just finished a long piece. Now I'm going to make a doily because I, I really like making these little doilies. Yeah, those are really pretty. I know you can't see it because it's 
really small yarn, really small beads. Come on, over there in the right spot. Nope. There you go. You got to talk to your work once in a while and make it do what you want it to do. Yep. So one, two, three. This one's blank. And the one at the end. Blank. Mary said, I got some tatting needles. I never knew it was so easy to do. It is. Very, uh, it's fairly easy to do. I think the complicated is when you start um, adding second rows and stuff like that. Yeah, I, I like it. I think it's easy, but I also crochet. So I think that I think it does help. I just couldn't, with my fingers especially, I couldn't work with anything that little, even if I could learn. Okay. Three. All right. That's that one. I'm making this one all beaded up all the way around. It's going to be kind of like this one. But this one doesn't have beads on every spot. This one I'm putting beads everywhere <laughs> just because I like them. And because you can. And because I can, that's right. And if I would quit making my stitches so tight, I might actually get the needle through. <laughs> you guys hear Jane playing this game? He does his own commentary. Speaking of the game, Meg, what's for? Seven nothing. Not you, Four Patriots. Four against you. Seven nothing, Patriots. Well, I took them tonight. Well, like I said, I mean, they should have no trouble beating them, but for some reason they have trouble with. We should have had. No it gets in their heads about, you know, the, the Giants because right. of the Super Bowls. Uh, thank you, Mary. Well, just as I went to read it, she she deleted it. I'm like, wait a second. I was in the middle of reading that. And then she said, oh, beautiful. Right. Yeah. I can. Oh, oh. I can turn it into a bad word. I'm trying to figure out what bad words we can make with ice. What? <laughs> I can't crochet or knit to save my life, so I will stay away from tanning as well. <laughs> Paula oh wants to know, Scotty, what's on your desk? File folder? I think she's um, talking to you. Yeah, it, well, it's a piece of a file oh. it's going with um say this is the page of my book it's a file folder that i made into a double pocket here and then there's a tuck down here too the pocket yeah she said the late with Our the lady, lady on it pocket. yeah a pocket here a pocket here and this pocket up here it's a three pocket oh that's cool all the pockets i haven't tried doing multiple pockets yet i gotta try that and the this so this is like a triple pocket 
and then it's just it'll just go well i i'm gonna make it a four pocket actually because i'm only gonna glue around here and here and here so this can be a pocket under here as well nice are you gonna do a tutorial on that <laughs> a tutorial a tutorial <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh my god. Uh, no. 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 No, it's this is a bull. Well, you gotta show me how to do that though. I want to do one of those. Okay. It's pretty simple. I know I just haven't it's done simple. multiple pockets like that. Sure. Sure. I you also could, have um, never done the waterfall thing either. I haven't done the waterfall thing. Um, my porch prints, she does that. She has a tutorial, a tutorial yeah. on it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> a tutorial on that waterfall. <laughs> yeah, so I, I just, she's too big for any of it. So I just have to. Uh, go into the small ephemera of Tracy and find something on there that's pretty. I like matching two different patterns because I like, you know, texture. <laughs> <coughs> I'll be right back, guys. I got to run that's down. That's 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 I got to get a cup of Joe. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> a cup of Joe. Some Java. <laughs> You're gonna get some Java. Some Java. Java. Yeah. I'm drinking some chai. And I'm just drinking water. <laughs> <laughs> you almost made me choke. <laughs> I didn't know you were actually drinking. Oh my god, that. I was on my way down, and that's the word, Michelle, when she says water. Water. <laughs> You'll hear yeah, that water when she's not thinking about it. I'll be water. Back. What? No, you water. don't have to it like that. Am I really saying pack? I'm not saying packets. <laughs> I'm saying pockets. You're confusing me with Maggie's voice. You're drinking chia. <laughs> what the heck is chia? Oh my goodness. All I can think of is Chia Pets. <laughs> right? Deborah's having a cup of coffee. Coffee. <laughs> a cup of coffee. Oh, I'm sorry. Now the score is 14 to nothing. Stop bragging. I don't want to hear it anymore. Sure, you are. I <laughs> speaking <in> English. <laughs> According to Lorna, I don't. <laughs> Not even close. Not even close to amazing English. Now, copy is a word that everybody, you know, a lot of people say differently. Like if you're from New York or. I say coffee. I just say coffee. I gotta make coffee. But if you're in your New York, don't they say coffee? Coffee. Kim loves your two oh, tag lip. Kim, yeah, I made it really simple. I just uh, stamped some um, background script and then just added the. I'm a sweetheart. <laughs> huh? She said, "But you're such a sweetheart." <laughs> yeah, Maggie's like, if you only knew. <laughs> the good old days with the yards. Yeah, oh. no one knows her like I do. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, Maggie is a Patriots fan, and I am a Chiefs fan. Yes. And Maggie's team just happens to be the team you either love them or you hate them. 
Yeah, most people hate them. <laughs> yeah. Yes, they're the ones that have been to the Super Bowl. But I'm really. okay with that, Louise. I'm okay with that. <laughs> Her dog is named after the quarterback. It's not my oh, dog. Yeah. It's uh, it's not my dog. It's my uh, grandkids' dog. She wants to know what kind of ribbon you're using on your tags. What kind of what? Ribbon are you using on I'm your tags? I'm not using ribbon. I'm using, like this was a little ticket. And these are, these are from Tracy too. What does she call these? Those are tags. Just, uh, tag toppers, whatever you want to call them. Yeah. And I used those. And then this one, I just, it was a piece off of, um, this was used to be a butterfly and I cut it up and this was the end of it. So I just use that. Anything that you can use to tug it up. That's Susan, all. But yeah, this is a little ticket. What's that? Amazing. Susan said she's back with taco soup and I said I made chili tonight. It was amazing. Yep, now she said that's what I meant. What are you using for your tag toppers? Yeah. That's coffee. Coffee. Mm -hmm. But New Yorkers say cough. coffee. Coffee. I'm going to get some coffee. Yeah. yeah. Coffee. Kim, you can do it with fabric. You can fold over a piece of fabric. You can fold over anything, really, to make a tape yeah. top wrapper. <clears throat> you can even um, cut out your own shape and you use it. You just cut it out big enough to fold it in half right yep i actually made um some ephemera made out of tags they're in my other book over there <laughs> Lily says coffee. I love yeah, that sound. Coffee. Yeah. Oh, the Giants just scored. Oh, they did. Oh, that's. Yeah. Hey, you can't shut out everybody. Wow, I've gotten a lot done tonight. Um, I don't even really get this much. Yeah, I have nothing. I have this. Nothing. <laughs> I think the, pic the picture that I'm going to use it will probably be off of her in, tr in Twitch. <laughs> I'd say that again. No. <laughs> This one. Oh yeah, I love those too. I've and, used some of those. And and then if you could even put her like maybe like this one right here on the front of this one and just glue it like that and make yeah. it a five pocket. Pocket. Let me put five it on pocket. It's the last thing you can do to make it a different <clears throat> to make it more more pockets like if i put right. these like ladies there and didn't glue them all the way down there could be one there or these flowers yep or i could um or i could i don't know stick an envelope on the side there or down here or up here uh -huh. And Kevin has a little pocket. 
lots of stuff you can do. Lots of ideas. Yeah. Yeah, I don't <laughs> usually get this much done, Lily. It's probably because I have a hard time reading the chat, so I just keep going. No, my no, this is a table, Susan, and it's not immaculate. Oh, you should see the side. The side of it. It's a mess. It's a mess. Oh, Lily, thank you. We pretend to be. <laughs> we What's just that? what do we work. pretend to be? <laughs> She said, you're all experts. Everything looks beautiful and absolutely professional. I said, we just pretend to be. <laughs> yeah. We just use big we words. We pretend to know. Like we know what we're talking know what about. Know what we're doing. Yeah. We just pretend. We just pretend. I want to do another script one. I'm getting to use my stamps and everything. I haven't used stamps in so long. I know. I just used that one today. Oh, and Fowler, I ended up uh, using my glue gun to stick it to the foam. Because it would not stick whatsoever with the self-adhesive. So I just glue gun that puppy on there. She's not coming off now. And bam, I'll have a stamp. Yeah. I missed it all, didn't I? Missed what? Everything, Laurel. Everything. everything. Missed everything. And goes there. Blood file folder leftovers. They're so versatile. They can. Yep, I can go versatile. You can use them with anything, like really. They're all. Awesome. Oh, I use glue gun on mine too. On what? On your stamp? What? I'm talking, I used my glue gun um, to, I had a stamp today that wouldn't, wouldn't self-adhese like it was supposed to. The backing of it, you know. Yeah. To, uh... Oh, that's what exactly what I was just looking for. I don't imagine that. Imagine that. Now I really am wondering, I'm sitting here with my big pile of ephemera and I'm really wondering what I did with all those printouts I did the other day of my portrait. I'm not really organized. I will never be organized. Just pretend. Just pretending. That was on my thing. Oh, that's the other thing. Organized? What? What's organized? <laughs> I think it's organized, but it's really not. It's organized chaos is what it is. My rotary cutter I was looking for. Jeez, if I just look around, I would find things. Are you done creating over there, Mags? Uh, no, I'm still going, actually. Oh, you are? Yeah. I can't see you doing anything, so. Oh, yeah, I'm just inking. I'm just going to finish up this tag, and then I think we'll probably call it a night. 
we've been on for uh, three and a half hours. Really? Yeah. Okay. Three and a half hours. Time goes by fast. I think anyway. They go by fast. My goodness. Three and a half hours is like a marathon for Maggie. <laughs> yeah. I got to get used to it again. Yeah, you do. My goodness. Are you going on tomorrow night, Laurel? Yep. Anybody's welcome to come on with me. I will. I will probably be able to. I don't think. Um, I don't think anything's going on. I'll come in and read your chat. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to be working on that amazing mixed media piece that I never finished. So I'm going to be finishing that. Nobody else has seen it but you guys. So that one from uh, Crystal's kit from her group. Do you remember with the paintbrush? And yep. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, thank you, Susan. She says, I've enjoyed you three ladies and the chat ladies too. Yeah, been all right. A good time. Always a good time. I always have a good time. We do have fun, don't we? Mm -hmm. Yes, we do. We we have no problem making each other laugh, that's for sure. Oh, that's for sure. Or making fun of each other. I was just going to say that. Yeah. <laughs> right there, matey. You know, you know, uh, Michelle, like those chairs that go up and down. Yeah, they yeah. love to make fun of me. <laughs> I'm your favorite subject to make fun of. With the lever that makes it go up and down. Right. You know they have those chairs with the lever. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh. Good thing I love you guys. You know it. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh! <laughs> I'll remember that for a long time. That was funny. Oh my gosh! Oh yeah, they got those chairs that go up and down. Well, yeah, Patty, you know, have you seen those chairs? <laughs> All right, beat, beat it to death, you two, why don't you? Just beat it to death. Oh, my God. And she was so serious, too. I was like, oh, my God. Fooling oh. Sendu. Oh, my gosh. Fooling oh, Sendu. Thank you, Ellie. She says, it's been wonderful for me, ladies. Your work is lovely. I've learned lots and lots. And got great tips and ideas. Oh, that's awesome, Lily. But I'm going to tell you, Lauren is going to tell you, you just spoke really bad English in the whole thing. <laughs> oh, we're not big on Max. We love Max. But, I mean, we all did it tonight. We all had a, where our brain was just like, what? <laughs> Well, you oh, don't, yeah. you guys don't. You can make fun of me all night long, and that would not bother me. Most of the time, it's warranted. I'll, I'll admit. Oh, I don't because care I don't all. think before I talk. Just like when I told you all to go over and watch Mandy's channel. <laughs> you finally get it. I got it a long time ago. <laughs> Actually, she said, she said learned. Who said learned? Oh, good, Deborah. I'm glad you had a good time. I hope you all have a good time when we're on. <laughs> right. That's the whole point. Tomorrow night we'll be on Laurel's channel. Yep. Fun Friday. Yep, and for me, it's a long weekend, so that makes me it even I have fun. Day off, so it's a three-day weekend for me. Oh, thanks, Lorna. <laughs> you guys want to see a really pretty magazine real quick? 
Yeah, let me wait a minute. Let me put on you. Let me get all this. Okay. I found this. It's from February 1907. Can you see it? Wow. <clears throat> it's called the Burr Macintosh Monthly. And it's from February 1907. It was 25 cents. And for a year subscription, it was only $3. And wow. then, yeah, it's bound together with this, um, like, a, it's almost like a baker's twine. But look, when you open it, the first thing you see is Fifth Avenue, New York with Tiffany and the clocks and stuff. But when you flip through, you know, I love that kind yeah. of right there oh, yeah it's like absolutely gorgeous yep and then it goes into look at these with the vellum oh nice yeah hold on i don't want to rip it <clears throat> but it has vellum paper oh. it's from she's from the metropolitan and it has like that silvery color on it yeah, and she's from the Metropolitan Opera Company. Wow. And look at her. Wow. They're all from, this is photo copyright 1906. Nice. Look at that. They're all You're cutting her head off. Oh, whoops. Yeah, right there. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, don't cut her head off, please. Yeah. <laughs> don't cut her head off. But there are. What time are you going on tomorrow? Theater. Um, probably around six thirty-seven. Your time, though, right? Yeah, my time. CST okay. time. So seven thirty-eight um, Eastern Your Standard time. time. Look at the back. Oh, For that's the cool. Of fashion. That is really that cool. From Paris, I know. Isn't it beautiful? It is. You found you found that in one of your outings. Oh yeah. Nice. I mean, the pictures in it are just. Listen, like, listen to man. She's like. <laughs> <laughs> Did you not hear her, Michelle? She's like. I don't know. Nice. <laughs> you found that in one of your outings. <laughs> <laughs> that is nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh Lorna says anything from Paris is cool <clears throat> Deborah um, Laurel will be on anywhere between um, 7.30 and 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time oh look at her Lily and Russell wow. Hello. love that so pretty oh they're beautiful images Carry her little muff Love that. Yeah, I was really, really pleased to um, find that. Really like that. It's very, very pretty. And the back, beautiful. Yep. I just love old stuff, you guys. I just love it. All right, ladies, we're going to say good night. Thank you for. Oh, that's here. awesome, Lily. I'm glad. Spending but we time want to see your work. And I just cut over Mag, so I'm going to shut up for now. Go ahead, Mag. <laughs> You're okay, Laurel. No, I was just saying, I'm glad. I hope everybody had a good time while they were watching us craft. I had a good time. I you know, had a good time. Back on live. I had a great time. Yes, thank you, Michelle and Laurel, for joining me. Absolutely. And I hope we'll, yeah, I hope we'll see you tomorrow night on Laurel's channel. It's due to be a fun Friday. You know how it goes on Friday. <laughs> right. Good night, everyone. Good night, Paula. Good night, Paula. Good night, Paula. That's okay. Good night, Paula. Night, Lily. Good night, Lily. Good night, yep. night Lorna. Night, night, night. night John. Good night, John night, boy. boy. Good night, Susan. Good night, boy. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh.